It's usually located at the center of the remote. This is where you'll find your internet web browser app. Select this to open and then type hochanda.com into the search bar. And this will take you to our website homepage, which includes our live broadcast and access to previous shows. So now you can watch, purchase and catch up with your favorite shows 24 hours a day, seven days a week on your TV, whenever you feel crafty. Hi, I'm Charmaine from Dolly Dimples Crafts and my passion is in card making and three-dimensional uh, paper crafting pieces. I wear a family run business and I just love making three-dimensional pieces and things that come to life. As well as using our products for card making, you can also use them for scrapbooking and mixed media and mixing some of your own products that you've already got in your crafty stash. I'd love you all to join us to watch us on Chanda and see the demonstrations and the hints and tips that I can bring to you. Um, great for new crafters and experienced crafters as well. So make sure you don't miss the Dolly Dimples craft shows on Achanda. Hello there and welcome back. Well, that, that little calming interlude bringing us into the show. Indeed. Do not be full because we're going to be busy. <laughs> and I know we're going to be busy for two reasons. We're talking Clarity Stamp and we're going back to stamping, which I always love with Clarity. And we've got the fabulous Maria. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm okay. Happy to be here. Good. And I know because some of the elements that we've got on the show, you kind of had an influence with regards to them. Well, I nagged for them. <laughs> yeah, that's one way of putting it. Yeah, that's how it was, really. <laughs> but we'll come to those bits in a few moments. But our one day special, we're talking brand new Christmas stamps. Yes. Who's designed these? These are our Mel, Mel Turner. Oh, um, yes. Our sort of long-standing in-house designer, mm -hmm. so she's, she's fabulous. Um, these are really very, very cool indeed. So they're beautiful Christmas stamps. We've got the four designs here. And what we've got in each set is a lovely sentiments with a nice font okay. and then we've got various elements okay right. so we can kind of build the branches but we can build our own branches if we want to okay. there are and what we're going to do in the very first demo we're going to kind of just introduce the concept of the stamps okay um, well i'm liking they, they're great fun well one thing i'm liking at the moment is 52 stamps for 24.99 yeah, that's deal. crazy yeah very much so these are just superb so here you can see this is just one of the beautiful branches now this i can't make up my mind whether we're going down the the mistletoe route here yes. or whether we're going down the berries. See, I like berries because they're bright and you can colour them red. You yes, see? So yeah. they can be whatever you want them to be. Um, so I think this is from our Elaine, actually, that this one. Good. And Elaine, just nice and simply, she's just done a little bit of sort of pattern building, very simply. Uh, and I'm going to do some pattern building myself with these stamps. Wonderful. And then the sentiment in the middle on our designer paper. I love that. Now, talking of designer paper, that will be your freebie in this hour, but I'll tell you about that in a few moments. This is a nice idea as well, like this yeah, one. Yeah, so this is our lovely Dady Paramore. And Dee's just done some sort of inky uh, techniques here with the she's just water-based inks and let the, the design run and then just add some, some glittery bits and then she's used the same stamp as the background there as well if you can see in a, a washy kind of way. Oh yes. Yeah. Very clever, like that one. Another one of my This is nice. It's got now a dreamy this, look to it. It absolutely has, hasn't it? So this is actually see all those little stamps. It's like a moon sort of shape, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. All those tiny little stamps are from um, the the, oh, the stamp set. Right. So she's created that half. Yeah. Oh Literally wow! Literally, just with the little tiny stamps. So you could you could make a heart, of or you could. a frame, absolutely. or a background. Anything you want. Oh my goodness! You want. Those fifty-two stamps are going to be very useful. Yeah, then. for sure. This this is one of nice. these. I didn't oh, put all of these at the top, I promise. Have I just gone picking for them out? Yeah, no, it's fine, don't worry. <laughs> I'm don't moving worry. things around here as well. <laughs> <laughs> so, again, this is Dee. Um, she started with our 
designer paper in the background and then she's used a couple of stamp sets so we've got the ivy here now i love ivy i know we're calling these christmas stamps yes. but ivy for me is all year round and being blue it doesn't look like ivy at all no, it almost looks like little blue bell flowers yeah, and then around the edge here so we've got just one of the elements there um from one of the other sets as well and then up here this is coming off oh <laughs> now these are the things that maria's had an influence with these fabulous baubles um and of course you can jump onto the website and you'll be able to find everything that we've been chatting about but this is a nice idea taking those stamps and making a bookmark bookmarks it's nice to give gifts isn't it yeah. it really is so i think it was this um yet yeah, Anne. um so and she's the the holly and again she's just used the one sprig of the holly and then she's introduced you can see about the berries here so yeah i've taken just a little tiny little stamp when you see them they are so cool I they this. really are and been busy with the parchments she, as yeah, well she has. so um what she's done here she's used a groovy border there the lovely kind of entwined ropey and then she's actually stamped and embossed onto the parchment there how beautiful like that idea now 10 percent of the stock has gone already oh my goodness it's very busy you can see at the bottom of the screen there we've got queues already on the phone lines talking about a minute and a half so not too bad at the moment it's likely they're going to get longer though so the website might be the place for you to place your order this is nice I like this that idea Andy. so andy's just done a classic kind of a panel card on some of our designer paper he's literally just sort of masked he's stamped and then he's just colored just a few of the of the ivy leaves like that. it's very elegant very looking, effective isn't it? now look at this wow yeah. another from from d get just beautiful so we've got our design paper so this is toffee apple and then if you move the card just slightly and you can see okay can Ooh, you see that okay, lovely yeah. yeah so d is actually heat embossed uh, gold onto the paper and then she's used a couple of our new acrylic shapes on there as Clever well idea. a bit of embossing really like cool. that um and now just man. one more to share with you can now do like this, this one get this is just this here this how Anne's done this this is two tiny little stamps we've got the outline stamp and the infill stamp oh, and then okay. in the here this is another element how cool is that I love it. tiny tiny little yeah. stamps I love it. From little stamps, big designs grow. Um, so <laughs> seven nine six four seven four. If you fancy taking advantage of your one day special, well, there you go. The details are on your screen. Whopping great, fifteen pounds saving. Bring that price down to just twenty four pounds and ninety nine pence. Seven nine six four seven four. Now, before we go any further, we need to mention our free gift because, of course, it's our birthday celebration. Yes. And is this what we're getting? Both of yes, these. Yes, I've opened them up so we can actually oh, okay. see. Attach in both packs. So you're getting your designer parchment. Yeah. So this is Barb's favourite. Okay. okay so what we've got here in both parts so this is a parchment so uh, we've got ten sheets and there are two uh, patterns in there so five of each you can see the colors Ooh. are very similar similar sort of colors so they're going to coordinate really really well but they're just very oh, slightly like different idea. so you're going to get and your parchment then we've got the paper as well and this is the paper yeah. of the exact same design same. yeah exactly that's oh, right that's so good. these are single-sided um, but as you can see we've got five sheets of the two designs and these are so nice you know whether you're just using them as backgrounds Ooh. or whether you're using them to stamp on and that sort of thing I've got a really nice demo that I'll get to either in the 8 o'clock show or in the morning um, it's just really nice and straightforward but because we've got this beautiful colour it you know it's, it's gorgeous yeah it's really oh, yes, nice God. gives you an opportunity to try those papers and vellum and parchment should I say if you've not tried them already how do you get hold of them well it can be simple all you've got to do is place an order during any of the one day special shows it's only one free gift per customer so if you place an order during this hour and you're tempted with more goodies at eight o'clock or perhaps tomorrow's hours then you will still only get that one pack but for every single order you will get that 10 percent credit that's going to be applied to your account um it will be applied to your account at the end of august but i'll tell you about that in a minute because i'm going to show you more that we've got here mm. so groovy plates now these are um, very similar to the designs that we've just seen yes so basically it's the same uh, it's the same artwork only uh slightly larger designs so what we tend to do is when we um you know put the designs on to um, groovy plates it tends to be just a little bit bigger so that's quite cool and again so we've got a lovely sentiment on each of the plates we've got the branches uh, in two sizes on here so that's how these differ we've got the okay. large branch and the smaller one but then also we've got a very cool corner on each as well so they are brilliant for you know sort of building up your, your uh, frames like and so idea. forth so this is our lovely Karen Karen Jackson um, so just the fonts on that is beautiful isn't it and then really the lovely uh, the ivy corner there I love that kind of Celtic look that you've got with the yes, script it there yes it is really lovely also great too you can because there's so many letters in there across the four plates 
You can make up your own words oh, as well. Idea, when we come to it, it, there's a really lovely sample. Um, I mean, there's lots of them. And um, this is uh, this is wrong. Um, I mean, this is gorgeous, isn't it? I On the black part, with gold and the red. Very, very smart. Beautiful. And I love this one. Teamed up with some of the designer exactly. papers. So, yeah. um, also, bringing into play your other groovy plates as well. So from these, this set here, Ronka's used the beautiful sentiment. And then down on her little candle window, can you I see uh, the holly there? Yeah. So, she's just, so again, this collection is going to, you know, just just work <coughs> combine really well with your other groovy plates as well. And look at Glynis. that. No, this oh, is absolutely... look at that work. That's just... Honestly, she's amazing. She really, I, I looked at it and I thought, I'm not even attempting that anything like that. There's no way. Absolutely beautiful. And the thing is, I love that because, of course, you can get truly creative. Create things like the wreath that we can see yes. here. Even though there's no circle on those plates, you make That's your own. Right. Exactly. So this is Linda. Really nice. So Linda's combined. Again, the lovely. She's put the berries in there. They could also be, um, uh, what's it? Well, you could, uh, we've said it up. Mistletoe, that's oh, it, yes. <laughs> if you wanted to. But beautiful, beautiful piece, piece there. Gorgeous. And then if you want to keep it simple with your colours, oh, then there's Emma. another way of working with Welcome them. Welcome back, Emma. Oh. It's a beautiful, lovely greeting there. And then Emma's used the uh, the holly corners and then in the um in, around there she's put some snowflakes from another of her christmas I love plates this. as bit well pergy glitter indeed yeah right, that works nice, well with that nice as well and um, so uh, just can i sneak in one more yeah this is very cool from karen as well i love this so you've got the yeah. little droplets on so there so what karen's done there she's actually used this branch as, a, as actual kind of christmas trees which is uh, really very Beautiful. very cool isn't do it? like that i was idea. looking for something i'll find it in a bit okay, okay, it's the front, actually i think ah. it's on the front oh is it, it one is. of these it's ones here oh is that the one that you're looking yeah, for which one were you looking for maria <laughs> this big one here. Oh. With, there you go oh that's pretty with love isn't it? at christmas oh the little hearts yeah but of course um, those little hearts and stars you could have a different sentiment for any time of the year that, that sentiment has been created with oh, the letters see, from, taking yes. bits. yeah that's uh -huh. clever. Thank you, Carol. <laughs> now, over 20% of the stock of the plates and the stamps have gone. From what we can see, lots of you are going for both of them at the same time, which does make sense because yeah. they do work so well together. But for the time being, if you're wanting your groovy plates, they are A6 a plate. So, of course, if we're working with our plate mates... They you... will. Well, I'm going to use mine in my regular plate mate with a space. I'm going to okay. show that. Um, but they will actually work in the groovy go. There's a lot of people invested in the groovy oh, yes, go yeah. set with uh, Tina's mm -hmm. doodle plates. Yes. They'll fit in there That's as well. Nice so there's well. different combos that they there you go. go fit in. All these things that we're chatting about we will explain to you but it's almost as if you are getting four for the price of three because each one of those would be $5.99 individually. In fact they are on the website if you're wanting to they know you can pay $5.99 but don't because all four of them come to you for less than £18. 336 616 is that item number. Now excited to show you these because this is something that's kind of come around through the exhibitions and your workshops yes, and things like that so and your retreats. We, we brought um, acrylic shapes quite a while ago and they were very very popular mm -hmm. and, and so forth and I bag seed demonstrating these down at our open days in, oh. uh, in Dinn, and um, and everybody really loved them and so forth but I was doing little you know dangly pieces uh, jewelry pieces um, sort of uh, baubly piece and you know key rings that sort of thing and what people were, with the feedback that I was getting from what people was it would be nice to have a pack that's just sort of smaller shapes mm -hmm. that have, have all got the holes in okay. so we can have a pack just to make kind of dangly sort of things so you know I fed that on to to Paul and, and he sort of um, made that it's happen. Gone through the the yeah. groovy tree so to speak and I'm just having a little look because you've got like yeah. a cover on there, there and I'm going to scratch it too much because you yeah. will notice that these are <laughs> blue. <laughs> <laughs> You'll notice that your pieces are blue and that's because they've got a little protective layer on there. They them. have on both sides okay. so they are actually crystal clear um, und underneath here. Okay I'm going to leave so. that one revealed just a little bit because it's a bit tricky getting that corner off. So yeah, yeah, no well, worries. We'll leave that I'm, for Alex at 8 o'clock. Yeah, I'll do one in a bit anyway. Perfect, there you no go. No problem at all. Um, so you're getting all of these. You're getting a lot yes, in there. Yes, there actually is. So what we've got is the various shapes here. Okay. Um, we've actually, they come in a really nice um, pack. And I've, I meant to put it up here. I can see it from here. It's down the other end. We've got Callum on it. <laughs> He's good, isn't he? It's, it's like, Thank it's you, like a cheetah has gone straight to <laughs> Straight to the. But look at these. I mean, these are beautiful. Obviously, they're clear when you're working yes. on them. But some of these have got paints on there. We've got inks you on there. You can use the all sorts. finish on there. Absolutely. 
yeah, I'm going to do, I'm really excited about the one day special because um, I've asked for all these different things. I've asked for um, some really cool paints and the mirror mist uh, and some alcohol inks and so forth. So I'm going to be showing as many de many sort of techniques with these as possible. Look at so they come, those. yeah, look at that. You know, it's a great little pack, a uh, blister pack there. So, and it tells you on the back exactly what you're getting inside. But there really is, there's such a lot in there. Um, we can make, you know, mobiles for maybe, you know, in a, in a nursery, we can make things dangling, you know, for in a tray. This is quite cool from, from Sarah. Let's just re-jiggle that a little. It fell on the floor earlier on, so yeah, There was a little it. clatter. <laughs> I hold it really nicely so we'd remember to hold it up because I didn't know where to put it. I love so, that. Isn't that cool? Sarah's... Um, They're almost Sarah's like little raindrops from the rain. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah? Exactly. Um, so they're lovely, they really are. So we've got the various different shapes and we can, you know, so we can do all sorts. Mm -hmm. um, even the kids can get involved. So there's uh, a necklace here. Um, now Amber made this for me. Oh. Um, she's been, while well, she's been off college, she's been, she's planted herself in the corner of my workroom. <laughs> and she's been doing painting and stuff I like that while that. I've been working. And she made, she went, can I have a couple of those shapes? I went, yes, all right then. So she, and then she, there you go. So I she love made that me, um, idea. Yeah, isn't that lovely? Amber's a sterling job. I can't believe that we are getting all of those for £12.49. Yeah. yeah, it really is. That it's is just phenomenal super, super. value. There's none in there that you're not going to use. Yeah. So, um, yeah. I love that. If you're wanting your 076467, and it's not limited to one per customer, so if you fancy stocking up on those, and the way that they are flying out, it's probably a good idea to do that, so, because way over 10% of the stock's gone. 076467 if you're wanting those. Now, wouldn't it be lovely if we could have a Christmas version of those? <gasps> It's sort of one, one step to the left. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I nagged him. I said, "Is it too late to ask for some?" We have some mini baubles as well, okay. and um, and then so I, I drove him a little bit crazy. Oh, um, he so loves it. He does love he it. He does it. it. Well, you know, we've got we've got the the baubles. These again are fabulous um, because we've got thirty pieces in the set. Oh, we've got all the different shapes. Isn't that beautiful? I love That's from that. That's from Paramore. Um, really, really lovely. And everybody seems to have different ideas. Um, um, within the team. So here, Sarah's jewelry. made some, some jewellery. So I think there was a few of us, and I don't make jewellery, but I thought, oh, we could do that, and we could do that, and we could make that. And, um, so, and then in here, we've got Ooh, um, okay. some earrings in here as well. So the box has been decorated. <gasps> and then, oh my goodness, they're beautiful. They? That's Jane, Jane Telford. Those are gorgeous. They so th I mean, all of a sudden, they're no longer baubles. Yeah. They're, they're dangly earrings. You know, I want to take these home and wear them. Well, the thing is, you look at those, you could quite easily charge nine ninety nine for these at a craft fair, couldn't you? You could. Oh, well, actually, you could also, you could make them on the day you, to sort of bespoke pieces point, actually, as well, yeah. couldn't you? Yeah. Or maybe you could make in a card and then actually yeah. have them as a gift within the car. Indeed, yeah, how cool is that? Really nice, so alcohol inks there, some embossing, Beautiful. and then the lovely stamps. Um, this one is very, very Look lovely, isn't it? Oh my Linda. goodness, this is beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Now a quarter of the stock of these ones have gone, I mean for £9.99. And don't forget, this could be the item that gets you your bonus gift, your free gift. You're getting mm. 20 pieces, um, of course you've got 10 of your papers, 10 of your parchments, but for £9.99 to get hold of this and have those as well, yeah. and get 10% credit. Wow. wow. Definitely worth a pay in a mm. part of. Four two five five seven six. Now, there's just one more thing to share with you before we head down to the demo. And these are all the brand new things that we're bringing to you. So I think it's important that we do see them in the flesh um, before we get down to the demo area. And this time we're looking at um, your acrylic book. Wow. So they're going to push me luck a little bit further. You are a cheeky Maria at the moment, <laughs> aren't you? I so I said, Paul, could we also, what about bookmarks? I had a great idea. I woke up in the night, actually. And I'm like, okay. Oh, bookmarks, that'd be great. So, so we saw. <laughs> But the other half wondered yeah. what was going on, didn't I was they? quite used to it, quite honestly, he's quite used to it. So what we've got here is the acrylic bookmarks, and they are sized really nicely to fit within our Pergamano bookmark sleeve, oh, so you can protect okay. them as well. Um, so here, this is really nice, isn't it? Um, I can't pretty. see who's this, so I, I apologise if um, if oh, I don't sort of name check. Any name but that's been done back and front, so it's been backed with some, some paper there, and then on the front on the actual acrylic, we've got alcohol ink and so forth. Love this it. is very cool. This is D. And look, you know, she's made even the back of the piece is pretty. Mm -hmm. It's all been been made pretty. So we can use inks and paints and just 
you know, all sorts. This is another really, really oh, nice one. Oh, I like one. this one. So kind of like yeah, this inks. is alcohol inks. And then actually, can you see the design that's in there? So that's actually using lifting. So it's Ooh. with the little stamps that we've got on the show, lifting the colour. Or you might oh. want to go bold. Oh, I love this. Yeah. Has yeah. Lou Withers got her hands on these? I can um, imagine she'd have a she, well, whale of a time. One. Wouldn't she just? Yeah. She'll have it in her bag, won't she? <laughs> yeah. But then, can I give a little sneak peek? Just a oh, little, little peek. Okay. At, uh, these, these are my ones. And I'm hoping to get to demo these. Okay. Okay. within sort of um, the, the the shows so because um, we've also got some uh, other stamps oh, on the show the and birds. those yeah it's a big stamp that and then you can see the lovely ivy um, oh yes and is the that name on the one day there? special yeah, it is and then the other one with the bright coloured birds same birds as on the bottom of the other one and then on the back I've just personalised it that one's oh, for Amber because she's, she's, she's a bookworm Oh. There you go. So these are lovely Beautiful. for gifts, and also you know, with those. all of the acrylic shapes, you can get the kids involved yeah. as well and get them making their, their their prezzies and stuff. We're busy. Yeah. We're very busy. Um, twenty percent of the stock of these have gone. You're going to get six of your bookmarks. I nearly <coughs> went all over. Put it in bookmarks. I nearly said Oops. that. It's rubbing off on me. Um, <laughs> ten pound and seventy-five pence. Six of your bookmarks. Six of your um, little sleeves there as well. And of course, again, like any of those other items, it's not limited to one per customer. One, two. Eight, nine, two, nine. We're going to head down to the demo area, but while we do so, feast your eyes on these finished samples. very very busy out there and um, it's really good to have your company don't forget if you've got any questions that you want to ask studio at chanda.com is how you can get in touch so maria what we're going to do where we're going to start? right i think we should just kind of introduce the stamps all good right? idea and just we've like got that idea. just some plain copy paper here okay and i'm just going to use a couple of the the stamp sets first of all and Lovely. just a, a, a nice black ink pad okay okay so we'll make a start with so this is the uh the ivy set so i have to it's a bit of a favorite i'll I like ivy I like mm. because it grows fast as well I, I can't kill ivy <laughs> I'm not good at plants but I I'm okay <laughs> with ivy so, so this is this is really quite nice so we've got the beautiful sentiments and then we've got the long uh, sort of uh, sprig we've got Call it a sprig. I think it's a sprig of ivy. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and then we've got the little separate elements, and then we've got these very cool little pieces here mm -hmm. as well. Okay, so um, let's just have a little look at this. Now, first of all, these are very, very fine line. Wait till you see okay. how fine. So, so should we? What kind of ink pad should we be using? Should we it consider that? It depends on the on the technique that you want to do. I mean, okay. for me, just um, because I'm just stamping it out, and on here, I don't intend actually doing anything with it and using an archival ink. So archival just use it ink, as an outline. Yes, that's exactly right. So um, archival ink is very good. It's permanent. So for example, if I then wanted <gasps> to um, sort of spritz with any sprays or water yeah. or anything like that, the line art would stay put. But Beautiful also it picks up every single and when you think about how fine this stamp is yeah. anyway you don't want to miss any of that, that looks like it's been drawn with one of those yeah. micron pens it's isn't just, it um isn't it beautiful yeah. so that's as it is so then let's just stamp another one and just change it ever so okay. slightly okay so i'm just going to bring this one in and i'm going to meet over here and we're going to elongate it that's clever so see now you're looking at um, a stamped border that quite easy yeah. I'm saying eight by eight card yeah indeed yeah so you can kind of piece up like so now then of course what we've got is our little pieces so we've got those on some small amounts here and instead so, all the amounts that Maria is working we've got those on the website yeah there's I'm, I'm using a variety so we've got some mini ones that I'm going to use in a moment and then at the moment I'm using the uh, the, the multi-pack that's got okay. various sizes Lovely. so so this one here so if we stamp it on its own that's what we're going to get. Nice. All right. So it's really lovely. And I, I've got a demo 
um, and I don't know which hour I'm going to do it, forgive me, um, because I've got okay. so much that I want to sort of show. And I've got a demo that is literally just using that one stamp. And one just, stamp. I really love it, I really love okay. it. So, um, so what we can do with this then, for example, we could extend this. So we want to, um, you know, we could also bend them on the mount as well. Oh, that's but let's say we want this to come to more of a point. Okay. So we could just come in here, like so, and we can just stamp that in oh, there that's and then we yeah so we've just kind of changed the shape a little mm -hmm. bit maybe you want to thicken yeah. the, the um you know thicken it out a little bit those lines okay. are so fine aren't they and then the same with this one this is quite a cool one as well so the same so let's stamp that so you can see it actually stamped like so so again we could use any combination of these stamps together mm -hmm. all right or individually they will work beautifully okay. now these ditty ones you've got to see these little ones they're so so cool um so what we've got on here is if i turn this over so we've got just the individual little leaves here mm -hmm. so there are the line arts there's four different sort of sizes or shapes some of them are, are leaning in that way some are going that way so you've got the line art, but then also we've got the infill. So let me show you how they work. Okay. Okay. So for these, because they're only Diddy, I'm going to use our mini mounts. So I think these, they've got a pack of, it's a pack of eight of these, I think, on the website. The See, minis. that's a useful thing to have, because you don't really want to be swapping these in and out. So you could have no. all of those on those eight mounts. Well, the thing to do, yeah, because in actual fact, there are eight of the little mini oh, stamps. Right. That'd be perfect. Yeah. You could just mount them on and then just sort of use them. Swap and them then And then put them away when you finish. Finished, all right so, um, just bringing those details up for you on the screen okay so what I'm gonna do here I'm just gonna use a couple of these let's get these on some mounts so we'll do a biggie and a diddy one lovely so we've got the line art and I notice you're putting them at the bottom of the mount as well yeah I am uh, I mean that's personal choice because then I can see better that's just for me I mean you can okay. see up here yeah but for me because um, I think it's with my very focals I just seem to get on better okay, but if there's no rule about where on the mount that you've got to put them it's fine okay. wherever it works for you is absolutely fine lovely. right so now I'm gonna grab another ink pad as well let's get um, a, oh, that's a nice colour, like this one here. These are the artistry inks, these, these are amazing. Um, these, well, actually, these ones are archivals because they're the first ones oh, I've used for. I could use the artistry. Oh, it's the box next to them, it's the artistry. Yeah, I could use the artistry if I wanted to. But just for the minute, I'm going to use, for no other reason than I like the colours. Okay, because okay? there the isn't website. a particular technique that I'm doing. If I wanted to do a technique where I wanted the, the colour to run or anything mm -hmm. like that, I'd use my artistry. Okay. okay, so let's take the lid off that this lovely prickly pear so I'm gonna take the the line art stamp okay okay of the little diddy and I'm gonna stamp it down let's stamp a couple okay just next to each other okay so that's the nice line art okay and then what we've got here is the infill so I'm gonna stamp this up okay now this is brand new I haven't used this one yet so okay. the first thing that I do when I ink it up I stamp it out as scrap first okay so I make sure it's kind of seasoning the stamp if you like yeah it makes sense okay so then what I'm gonna do excuse the top of my head no, that's I'm gonna fine. come across here and I'm gonna just look down through the stamp and that's the go. beauty and I'll get you to position another one if you can because yeah. this is where the mounts really come into their own because they give you the ability to kind of hover and get it right in the right position because yeah. Yeah. Um, we saw a, a little shall bit there of okay. if you can position do, it and then shall I move my head away yeah, is that gonna, I think is that gonna this is why because sometimes <laughs> people might look at these and think yeah. oh well, I've already got my acrylic blocks yeah. I don't need these okay but Miriam so I, holds that and we kind of zoom yeah. in do okay. not adjust your sets <laughs> Okay, All and right. you'll be able to see that when actually Maria places that down, it's absolutely yeah. spot on, I as you can see there. Go. There you go, you can see there, that's see. the shot, that's the yeah. one we wanted. Okay. Perfect. So it's Look right inside. And then now also, now let's imagine you haven't got a very steady hand, because mm -hmm. sometimes I haven't got a steady hand, I'll be mm -hmm. honest. And sometimes when I'm doing this, I've worked quite quickly and I've had the stamp and I'm going dun, 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 dun. You know if you miss a little bit, mm -hmm. it's a shadow and a highlight. It's a good point, actually. Okay. 
And since Don't when has so every off. ivy leaf been exactly the same as the next there one? There you go. One question I will ask you, put yep. the outline down first. Yep. Does it matter which way around you do it, personal we preference? We recommend that you do put the, the outline down first. Okay. Because then you can actually see the outline to be able to see where you're sitting your any stamp into. And I'm guessing that if it kind of goes off a little bit, then it doesn't matter. Whereas yep. the other way around, it could make a difference. Yeah. Okay. I mean, as I say, you know, if it doesn't quite sort of line up, let's do one and let's try and... I'll get this perfect now and I'm trying to do it <laughs> not perfect. Can't, yeah. Yeah, let's just try and do it really quick. There you go. So that's off, way yeah. off. But who's to say that's not lovely as well? Well, this is it. It's just like that little you know, highlight, isn't it? But you can yeah. see those, you know, f f first yeah. just straight in, straight in. It's the, They're really, yeah, they're please. a joy to use. <coughs> they really Fabulous. are. Now, the other set that I want to um, sort of show, because what we've got is um, we've got the holly, um, we've got the ivy that you've just seen, and we've got the beautiful. I said I just don't know whether to call it berries or. It can be or whatever you want it. It is to be. exactly what you yeah, want it to yeah. be. Because it could be so, throughout the summer. You could use that. Yeah, for sure. Now the other set that is, it's kind of the the naked branch. Now this one is such a fun set. This is okay. kind of a little bit different from from the other ones. Okay, so let me just take these little bits and put them back on the carrier. Also, it's where can I just give a tip here about? Yeah, please. The carrier sheets, okay, so they're now printed on there and it's worth keeping them um, with the, the carrier sheets because if you're not sure which of these um, uh, stamps that you need, yeah. say for example we stamped out one of the, uh, the ivy, what we can do is actually bring it over and we can actually check yes. which one, okay? So yeah. we know that it's that, it's that So one. you can take that to one of these stamped images and figure out which there of the leaves you need, okay? Right, so let me just carefully... Um, pop these little bits back. Very, very busy for these guys. You can see um, on your screen you've got the deal for the one day special, including all of the stamps that we're working with at the moment. 796474. Lots of us engrossed in the demonstration, but even so, 30% of the stock has gone. You've got £15 saving with these, considerable saving, um, and £24.99, a very affordable set for anybody to get hold of. 52 stamps you're getting for that, which is brilliant value. It kind of works out a little more, well, it's a little less than 50 pence a stamp, isn't it, actually? Mm -hmm. When you work it out, yeah, forty-eight p. Forty-eight p. I did that crazy, in my head. I didn't do it bang on perfect with the pennies, but I knew it was about fifty p. <laughs> so, um, so there you go. Um, a seven nine six four seven four, but very very useful set. Um, was there something else that you wanted me to say as well, Charlotte? I wasn't listening. Oh, your free gift, yeah. Oh yeah, sorry. It's nice to have a I'm just, yeah, well, you see, yeah. I'm, I'm a, I like watching what you're doing and I forget that I'm supposed to be here doing stuff, so I <laughs> can't help it. Um, your free gift, you could be getting hold of your one day special and not only have you got a £15 saving, which let's face it, is good enough in its own right, you will also get your duo pack where you are going to get your 10 sheets of your parchment, you also get uh, five different... Um, Two, sorry, two different designs, five sheets of each of those, and exactly the same with regards to your papers as well. Your designer papers in there as well. You're getting those, and we're giving you 10% credit back. I think somebody's had a bang on the head, to be honest. We're giving you all these easy. fabulous deals. It's mental, isn't it? Mm. Wow. Lovely. Right, okay, so I'm just putting a couple of bits onto, onto mounts so we Lovely. can have a little play with this set as well. So first of all, again, this is very, very fine line. Okay, so let's stamp this out. See, this one could be a, a frosty sprig. Yeah, absolutely it? Just could. And so if you're creative, you could kind of add an element of a feather to the outside of this with a little wiggly line, couldn't you, if you wanted yeah, to? Yeah, indeed. Get your fine line pens yeah. on. So it can just be a naked tree. Yeah. Okay. It does look kind of feathery, actually, yeah. though, doesn't it? All right. Or it can be, let's say, we can bring it in from here, mm -hmm. okay, so it's coming in at an angle, and we could do danglies from it. That's okay. a good idea, so yeah. So, somewhere here, I've got a pen. Because it's got, got a bit of a, kind of a, a almost like a, I don't know what the, the type of tree it is. I want to say fur tree, but it's not yeah, a fur. Yeah, no, there's, there's but one it's similar, whispy. isn't it? Yeah, I, I know what you mean. It's kind of got a fluffy, they? fluffy bit mm, to it. Yeah. Um, I can't think. It's not very no, descriptive. It's, it's, no, it's There's not. a tree out there, and I don't know what it is, but I just remember that you've got kind of, it's, it's quite, quite kind of twiggy, but then you've kind of got like a, um, a, a white fluff to it. Yeah. And I think the fluff is the seed element. It's a good job we're not selling plants, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder why that garden centre didn't get back to me when I applied for that job. No, you know. I think I know. I know. Um, yeah, I don't know. But, yeah. 
Right. I want to say broom, but I don't think it's called broom. I, I think don't that's know. a different type of plant. I'm not a clue. Anyway. <laughs> right, so we can play with this because we've got the different elements. So on here, we've got little hearts, we've got stars, we've got diamonds, we've got like little teardrop shapes. Um, and again, so we've got the innie and the outie. And then we've got all the little kind of flourish details, if you like, that we can kind of um, use to extend the, the branch as well, mm -hmm. if we want to. So let's just use one of those. Let's say when you get these home, my suggestion is take some, some copy of paper and literally just pull and come up with some sort of compositions so just nice and easy this one and all I want to do is just literally just extend this like so oh hang on a minute let's do that one instead I'm go. just chuckling to myself all the different things they use in a search engine to try and find <laughs> with that terrible description that I've given them I'll oh. try and think about it and if I do find it I'll have a little look when I get home and then I'll let you know tomorrow yeah right here we go so you can see we can extend and we could put that on as many of those branches as, as we want we could put any sort of combination um, of the of the little branches have a little lock excuse the top of my head Right, oh, so it's just that. nice and easy um, to to line up. Okay, let's do uh, let's do one coming down a little angle. This there. is where these mounts are so useful because they're not over, they're not thick. They're no. Sometimes with an acrylic block, it can distort sometimes it can a little distort, bit. Can't distort also it? the weight of it and the size yeah. of it for gripping. Whereas with with our handles, it doesn't matter how big it is. You know, even you know the large ones. Yeah. You, you only hold it the, the same way, and they are lightweight. And I said they are thin as well, so there mm -hmm. isn't the distortion. Right, so then we've got these other um, little bits going on here. So we've got, let's have a little look at the, the heart. Okay, so let's do some, some dangly hearts from here. So I'm going to pop one there. And we'll pop one there. And we'll pop one down here. I'm literally just playing. There isn't a plan for this. Okay. I just wanted to show how easy it is just to, you know, play with the with the stamps. Let's get a couple of hearts in it. Look, a couple of star, uh, stars. So let's actually let's put the stars over here on this okay. one, so we can put them right on the, the ends of the branches right. if we want, like so. Let's put one there. Okay. And again, we've got the other different shapes as well. Just play. You know, you can change the look of this so much. Gosh, right. Just think of a different idea. If you've got an alphabet set, you could kind of leave open branches where you're wanting to put a letter, yes. for a name or a greeting, and then yeah. fill it in with little hearts and stars for the other branches. For sure. We have actually got a very cool alphabet on the show. Oh, OK. We've got the word chain alphabet and numbers, which are really cool. Oh, so I'll be that's why you were those. just giving me a little glint in your eye then. And I mentioned <laughs> it. I thought, what should I put it in? Alphabet, I didn't realize. Alphabet, there you go. <laughs> right, so now we've got the innie, so I'm going to go with a, with a red. So again, I'm just going to come across and I'm looking through the stamp. There you go, straight spot on. Spot on. And again, you know what? If it isn't spot on, I am, there you go. See, we've got a tiny, yeah. but look how cool that looks. It looks like I tried to highlight it. Yeah. Looks like I'm clever. But you know <laughs> what? You're doing this quicker than I would take using a pen to fill them in with colour very much yeah. so yeah so but you've got that option as well you yeah. know you can colour if you want these if you want to to go mm. down this route okay. and then we've got the star let's do let's grab a little, tiny quick bit of yellow lovely and then and i think we've kind of shown the idea then really haven't we behind yeah. there well, to be fair, I mean, we get five live hours with our one-day special. So yeah. I think you could probably do 55 hours to fill these. Absolutely, too, because there's yes. so much scope with regards to what yeah. you're doing. Sometimes the hardest bit is actually figuring out what, you know, what, what we are yes. going to do and what yeah. we're going to leave out, you know, because of five hours. And then let's just, because we want them to dangle, so we're going to take this like so. Oh, that's a clever okay. idea. So we can either do just a nice straight line. Or we can do a little stitchy line. It's up to you. Just play. So all of a sudden, again, now that, you know, there's nothing on there that says Christmas, is there? This could be Valentine's. It could, could be for, for, for your oh, family. That's what, lovely. Whatever. whatever. That is fabulous. 
And that's a really good idea. Just have a little dabble yeah. and a bit of copy Just paper. Just get some copy paper, stamp the stamps out and, and get to know them and you'll have such fun with them. Lovely. Yeah. Right, Marie, I'm going to let you get ready for your next Okay. Um, you guys are going to tell you about that credit, that 10% credit you'll be generating by placing an order during our event. Any of those shows you if you play and it's in an interest, then it's a 10% credit that will be applied to your account. Now, um, it's on the 30th of August that it's going to be applied to your account and it means that when you actually start shopping from the 1st of September, actually it might be the 31st of August. Is it 31 days in August? I can't remember. Yes, it is. So the next day you can uh, redeem it straight away. So right the way through to um, the 30th of September, which is good if you get paid on the 31st because you can use that credit. Mm, there you go. 796 at 474 is the item number for you to get hold of your one day special and that might be something that you'll be going for during this event. Um, it means that you will be say, uh, getting yourself around £2.50 a credit towards your account and of course we've got um, plenty of time for you to gain more credits but it's not just about that. It's about the usability. It's about the beautiful content that you've got within the set that gives you the ability to create so many different styles of cards. Of course we're looking at predominantly Christmas, especially some of those sentiments, but you will find that you'll be using these all year round. I mean we've got a little Christmas bauble here using some of that mirror mist on there to turn it into a little mirror, a few little bits of alcohol inks in there, but again that fabulous sprig that's it. I love the way that the kind of the design runs off that and then into the background and again from the middle out. Who's created this one? Um, this is Linda. I haven't got my glasses on, sorry. I should have thought of that, shouldn't I? It's like, yeah, I'm like this. Yep, that's Linda. That'll be Linda. Now, look at this. Wow. Oh, how amazing is that? That's a real explosion of colour. And that's exactly what um, Jane has done here. Uh, but she's it actually is, can you see, just tucked away there. You can hardly see it. But it's just adding that finer detail there, that little bauble just in the centre there but that could be a little gift and um, pretty much included with your card um, again Linda has been busy with those little uh, clear, um, a cleric a acrylic I've got my L in the wrong place then um, create a little Christmas pudding I love that idea that is really clever because of course you can see there a little bit of white embossing powder um, has been melted to create you your kind of brandy butter on there I like that. Lots and lots of different ideas. Again, and you come up trumps with these designs. Absolutely beautiful. And again, Sarah, a lovely, lovely way of using those together. And I've got to bring up this last one here. D Paramour. In fact, I'm going to bring up another one because I'm being naughty. That particular one there, I've just got distracted. Again, D is created with that one. But have a look at that. Similar to the idea that um, uh, we just saw with Maru. But what a clever idea, making your own little Christmas tree there. And that's Andy. Andy again. We'll look at more of those finished samples um, as the hour progresses. But what was that update again, Sarah? Oh, gosh. Rapidly approaching 40% of the stock. This is your time to get your order in place. I've stepped away from Maria. I'm not offended in the slightest if you're not listening to what I'm saying. What I would rather you do is get hold of those pieces that you can craft with. Then we'll get back to the demonstration and then, of course, Maria can give us more inspiration. But for the time being, if you want a new one-day special, the details are there. 52 stamps coming to you for just £24.99, 796-474. Very quickly, the groovy version. So perhaps you're into your stamping, perhaps you're into your groovy, perhaps you're into both. Whichever the situation is, these are beautiful. You recognise the elements that we're looking at here and you've got your A6 plates here. Now, of course, they're going to work with your regular groovy system if you've got your spacer bar which many of you will have already or if you've got your groovy goat then they will pop in there just nice and easy and of course many people have just invested in their groovy goat just to get started with the, the groovy system so these are going to be welcome additions to your collection it's like you're paying for three of these but we're sending you four because at 5.99 that is your saving on this which is what you'd normally be paying and again Similar to that stamping exercise that we saw with uh, Maria, that's where you will find lots of those crafting environments crossing over. So the skills that you learn with your stamping can be applied to your groovy system. Karen has shown just how effective those little trees or those little sprigs can be. Again, beautifully traditional with that font, as you can see here, Chris Walker. Very traditional parcher with regards to um, design. So I love that. And a little bit of stamping going on in the background, perhaps. But have a look at this. Oh, my goodness. Linda, Linda Page with that gorgeous outside edge there. Beautiful frame built together. But again, a little bit of coloured parchment going on there, as you can see. Um, and Josie, the wonderful Josie with her cut work. Have a look at that. 
That is absolutely amazing. Of course, you've got Jane Nestorenko's frame as well. That's another one that's a very useful frame, and you can see Chris has used that one. But then another very modern twist put on these designs by our lovely Linda Page again. Again, 40% of the stock level peggings. I think you're going for both of these guys. Um, £17.97. pence. Very affordable. And as you're adding all these items into your basket, are you getting towards that £60 threshold? Because that will mean you can spread the cost over two payments with flexi order in fact these acrylics might be the things to go for to take you through that 60 pounds threshold they're only 12.99 and you're getting loads of them in there brilliant value for money you've got all sorts of shapes in there tags and squares and hearts they are all in there and third of the stock has gone 12 pounds and 49 pence we'll get those to you and we've also got another bundle the christmas bundles which are 9.99 and you're getting 30 shapes within these and half the stock has gone of these um very very popular and marie is very pleased that you're liking them as much as she does she's doing a little happy dance bless her um four two five five seven nine um and then of course your acrylic bookmarks these are something else that's definitely worth thinking about. 40% of the stock of these have gone. These are brilliant if you're wanting to do anything with your word chains. They'll fit in there gorgeous, beautifully. And of course, your one day special perfectly too. £10 and 75 pence. And of course, those acrylic pieces. I love the packaging. You're getting so much within these. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These ones being your 42 pieces with your hearts and all the different shapes in there. And these ones being your Christmas baubles. Love these. So what we do next? Right. So we're going to do just a nice, clean and simple, okay. a little bit of kind of pattern building. We've we've just sort of had a play. Mm. Now we're going to actually make a card. Okay. All right? Lovely. Um, we, we've got to use a bauble. We've got to use a bauble. So I'll show you what we're <gasps> going to oh, lean Maria, towards. That's okay. gorgeous. Oh, look at that. I like that. That mm. is beautiful. Look at that. There we go. That is amazing. Nice bit of mirror. Is it tricky to do that? No, we're going to do it. We're okay. going to do it in a minute. Lovely. Right, okay. So I'm going to start off then. Seven inch uh, stamping card, stencil card. All okay. right, nice size. I'm not cutting it down to size, okay? okay? Because if you cut your card down to size and you're unsure about, you know, where things are going to land, that sort of thing, then you can run out of road, okay? okay. Whereas if you start with a bigger piece and then trim it down, you've got room for error. Okay. All right? So what I've done then, I've mounted up our, our lovely berries lovely. onto uh, a mount. So all we're going to do, first thing, we're just going to stamp it four times. Okay. As simple as that. Lovely. All right? Go on. Just to give you a little time check, we've got a little over 10 minutes. Okie okay, dokie, okay. no problem at all. Right, so again, I'm going to use the um, archival to get really nice, crisp effect on that. So I'm just going to sort of start about here okay? okay so just gonna you'll notice i'm not pressing on the handle here yes, i'm yeah. pressing on the back of of the mount okay here we go oh, so that's such one a lovely image all right it's crispus mm -hmm. so i'm going to turn the card and i'm going to stamp it again so make sure give it plenty of ink and then i'm going to come in about here now let me just remind myself where I went so yeah I just sort of touched now here's a little tip see while I've been hovering and mm -hmm. I'm going right what did I do where did I go mm -hmm. difficulty with doing that is that archival ink is drying on your stamp so if ah. I went down now and stamp that the chances are I wouldn't get a lot oh go yeah patchy. so be sure know where you're going and Before so that you, you can ink and go straight down all okay. right just a little tip okay so i'm gonna just re-ink again and go again all right so i want this kind of round about there okay like so okay so again i'm pressing on the back of the stamp there we go perfect so I'm gonna turn it again Lovely. Now, if people are familiar with stamp platforms and they want to use these stamps with the stamp platforms, is that okay? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, they work really, really well with your, your platforms because, you know, it's just you position the stamp and you mm. just move your card, okay. you know? So, yeah, absolutely go for it. Here we go. Beautiful lines. One more. Okay. And away we go. So I want these to meet nicely. So I'm looking over there. And we're looking over at the other side as well, like so. Okay, right. So that is my most basic 
frame. Now that on its own is really quite I nice. Do like that, yeah. It's got a lovely kind of sort of flow. It's got like a sweep, like a little, yeah. yeah, like a sweep. I was going to say flourish, but Ooh. yeah, it's a sweep. Is, yeah, yeah, I like that. Sweet. I like that. So what if we want to thicken it out? What if we want to just change it up a little bit? If I bring okay. the original back in, what you'll see here is there's a little bit more going on oh, in the corners. Oh, yes, there is. Yeah, okay. So we can do a little bit of that. So in comes our little individual uh, little stamps there. So this one here has got the two berries on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let me figure out where I'm going to go. So I can come out this way. Mm -hmm. Now I did that. Okay, so I'm just doing a planning. Yeah. So I'm going to do that first. Okay. And this is what how I, I how I prep this. I looked and thought, right, now I want to thicken it out. So I came here and I did okay. that all the way around. And then I thought, right, now what do I want to do? Yeah, that makes so sense. that's what I'm going to do here. So I'm just going. I'm following the shape of this one here. Mm -hmm. See that? So I'm kind of going opposite it yeah all right avoiding the other berries we don't want any to overlap and there's no real need for them to overlap there we go that's that one this is, this is like you're making your own stamp now with this yeah this is the beauty of you know little stamps and this is actually pattern builders where barbara yeah. started all those years ago with one little color yeah. stamp you know and and, um, and and we're still doing that now we're still loving doing that little stamps are great all right so now we've got a slightly different shape yeah yeah so let's get we've got kind of a bit of an empty area here so i'm going to have a little hover and i'm going to look over here and i'm going to think yeah i can get another one there oh, so okay. same stamp okay I'm going to come in, I'm going to drag that one off, that little branch there, okay? Hey, there look you go. at that! Yeah? Wow. So, so now all of a sudden it's really quite full, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So let's take that round. And that's a good four. idea actually, to do one, one stamp and then do the rotation, because I know that if I did the two stamps, phone would go or get distracted, and then I'd come mm. back and it's like, now, which one, where did I put it? Yeah. So yeah, just take your time. Mm -hmm. Enjoy the, the process. Here we go. One more. Across there. There you go. Now we've got a completely different exactly. frame, haven't we? But isn't that lovely? That is it. Just two stamps, and it's just completely different from if you think that the actual original stamp was that. Yeah. It's a whole lot different, isn't yeah, it? it just, yeah, But cool. then it could be a rose hip, it could be gypsophilia, yeah. it could rose be... Rose hip, there you go. Yeah, it could yeah. be, um, uh, well, whatever berry, mistletoe, as you said yeah. before. Could be, do you know what? It's whatever you want yeah. it to be. Right, so now we've got choices. So colouring. Now, the thing is with these stamps, because we've given you the different elements, so we've already explained how these little stamps work so you can colour mm -hmm. one in. All right, but these ones, okay, and same with this one, are for you to colour yourself. So what we want to hear was give the the option of being able to colour the little ones mm -hmm. with those. But then here for the colourists, the people that yes. like to sit and play and mm -hmm. you know and, yeah. and do all the, all the colouring. So it's something for everybody. Now the thing with this set is a lot of those little diddy ones don't just work with each other and with these little ones. They work with the big one as well, oh, okay. which is just fabulous. It just the set just keeps giving it really does so I happen to know that most of these little berries here I can fill with this one little stamp okay so because I've already got the outline okay on mm -hmm. those I don't need the outline stamp I just need the kind of the fill bit okay, okay? so um, now we can go red or do you want to change the color I don't mind. I'm just in awe of what we you could. could um, we could go with a, a green. Do you know what? Let's stick let's with the red. Because of time wise, let's do this. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. All right. So I'm having a little look at which way. So, so the berry, we've got a little tiny dot in there where yeah. it's kind of the highlight. So I've got that in the same sort of, um, it, that's facing upwards. Okay. All right. So remember which way um, that you're working. So I'm going to have a little look over here and I'm going to go so I know that I'm facing the right way. All right. Okay. So again, let me just prime the stamp and just stamp a couple off here so I know and this is because it's a new stamp you've not used yeah it's always a good idea even when you haven't used a stamp you know even for a couple of hours oh, I make see. sure it helps you really really um, you know get plenty of ink onto mm -hmm. the stamp right here we go so again excuse excuse my head all right so I'm just gonna come straight down there you go look at that and that lovely Love so we're gonna go up on that one and again you know what if they're not all perfect I'm not gonna beat myself up at all I'm really not because I think it's just gonna be but again lovely. this is quicker 
Well, this is quicker than I would find with the um, the current. Because you know what would happen is, and I don't know if you ever found this at school. It's that when you get started, the first mm. page of an exercise book, it's your neatest writing yeah, ever, it's isn't it? That's best writing. And then as time and then, goes on, and it gets worse. And it's worse kind of and trails off, and then it gets to the last page, and you're like writing across. like this because yeah. you know that you're going to get a new book at the yeah. end of it. Yes. I would start if I was colouring that with pens. The first side there would look yeah. fabulous, and then it'd be like, oh, I'm going to do this four times. And then you get onto side three, and start this. And then you've got to do like another three dozen of them and yeah like, oh, me, they haven't said that i mean how many people out there absolutely love their coloring in and true. that it would give them the, you know so much it pleasure is. to just sit and but it also and means you could actually set these up and then yeah. take your half a dozen or however many three yeah. dozen of those card bases and take them off to work with you or yeah. doctor's waiting room or hospital if you've got yeah. an appointment and actually be coloring in For sure. just with one pen yeah that's yeah. a really nice thing to do yeah. so that's how we can color and i've got all the coloring methods that we want to get through over the five hours i'm really Quite excited about okay. them. But so let's just we'll put that to one side and then I want us to get bubbles. Right, yes. so let's crack one of my new packs and we'll crack it open. Oh. Come on, crack it open. Now there we've go. got two different options for you with regards to um, your, your bubbles and your acrylic pieces. Actually, we've got three because you've got your bookmarks as well. So we've got your 9 99 with regards to your bubbles there on your screen. But of course, everything that we're hearing from Maria and seeing from Maria, of course, you could transfer over to that other pack, the 42 piece pack that you've got, which is at the bottom of your screen yeah. with all your different shapes in there, your hearts and your diamonds and all those other ones that are in there. Lovely. Okay, right. So first of all, we've mentioned that they've got a protective film on. Yes. It's on both sides. So literally, that will just just peel off. If you find that it's a little bit uh, stubborn, then see, I'm, I've, got, I've got fingernails, you see. I'll give it a bit of a... But get your pokey tool on there or whatever you would normally use. But just do be it's careful. Just getting purchased on yeah, that, isn't just, it? Yeah. Just on the edge. And once you've got the edge, then it will come away for you. Oh and then what God. you're going to find then is you've got lovely crystal... Sh clear Ooh, lovely that. shape like that wow. to work with yeah mm -hmm. okay so what we're going to do here we're going to use a mirror mist i'm going to okay. stamp on there as well so now we need to use both sides because because i'm going to stamp with a permanent ink if i then spray mirror mist on, on on top of that well for one thing from the other side the writing's going to be the, the wrong way around of course it will but the mirror mist the, the solvent in the mirror mist would mix would blend with the with the ink and it would actually run okay right. okay so that's a good thing to to remember so let's stamp the front first of all now you can use if you like stays on mm -hmm. um, then then go for that the, the beauty of stays on it's not an ink that I use a lot to be okay. honest um, but it will dry very quick almost instantly on the mm -hmm. acrylic okay um, but for me I'm going to stick with my archival because the archival will also dry on there it just takes a little bit longer that's all okay so I'm just going to come down here so the love and best wishes Okay, so straight down. Try not to let this wiggle around. Give it a little press, and away you go. Okay, and then we're going to use our little berry. Now this time we're going to use the little three of our berries. I'm going to stamp a couple of those into place on here as well. Lovely. Now the baubles, so, just to let you know that 60% of the stock has gone of the Christmas baubles that we've got on the screen. You're getting 30 of those for 9 99 um, Yeah, lots of you taking advantage of these. If you're looking at getting them and you're wanting more than one set, I do suggest you do it sooner rather than later. Okay, so now I'm going to come in and I'm going to colour with, with um, an archival pad. Okay, so again, straight over the top. All right. Um, let's see, I missed a bit there, but I'm going for it anyway. It'll okay. be okay. I'm, I'm not breaking my heart over this. Any tips to actually stamping onto the acrylic? Because sometimes things can slide. Yeah, just they? just try to sort of put, you know, hover and yeah. then try it down and and straight back up. Okay. But here's the beauty of the acrylic shapes. You know, if this was all all went pear shaped, or if I was being a perfectionist, I could actually wipe this off on the original. I slid on one and I actually wiped it off. I've got a dirty uh, cloth yeah. and a little bit of uh, blending solution, alcohol Took blending solution, off. and you can actually wipe these completely clean. So you Wonderful. can start again if you need to. And so that is like that's that's quite cool. Okay, I right. like that. Uh, just to give you time, check Marie. We're really running out of it. We've only got yeah. about a minute and a half left. Okay, right. So let's just mirror mist. No problem at all. There you go. Right. So that just needs a second to dry. Okay. So we're going to crack open a brand new Should mirror I blow mist. On it? Yeah, I've got a heat gun as well, but we're going to go for it anyway. We're not going to worry too much. 
here we go. So this is a brand new one, so I'm going to be giving this a nice shape. Lovely. And um, these right. are coming up. The details on your screen. You're getting a set of three for seventeen ninety nine. Yeah. So this one is for the plastic. You've got a bottle for plastic, a bottle for glass, and you've got the varnish as well. So let me just give that a tiny little whiff. A little, little waft. Yeah. Now, time is ticking away. We're going to continue with this right up until the wire. But don't forget okay. that Maria is going to be back at 8 o'clock with Alex with more from the one day special. Um, and with that one day special, over 40% of the stock has gone. Okay, here we go. Watch carefully. Look at that. She didn't need any more than a minute. Look at that. Oh. Now, it's worth mentioning, at home, I use a far less, um, uh, what's the word, that needs another coat, actually. Okay. Uh, a far more gentle heat gun, all right, because okay. it doesn't blow it around. So one of the hairdryer type ones. Yeah, that's right. It's much, yeah. you know, you don't want it blowing more around. Okay. It's just, there we go. But saying that, you might want it, because I kind of like that little... Yeah, it's of, quite cool, yeah. sort of, uh, pattern off it. There's yeah. a little bit of Come on, a, a bit of scaly um, effect to it. Yeah. Um, look at that, amazing. There and then, of go. course, with your finished sample, yeah, where is this Jump to the, the finish one. Perfect. So Ten see. seconds to go. I love there it. Maria, thank you. Thank you right very much. To the Just wire. Flies by Sorry, guys. Again. Thank you. Tune back in at eight for more. <laughs> <laughs> one day oh, didn't she do well? Good evening, Shanda, coming up straight after the break. Um, and there's going to be three of us there. I hope you can join us. And hopefully, Maria will come in as well. Make that four. Celebrating after that with um, Clarity. Again, a repeat of the eight o'clock show. We'll go through the night as well. Hi, I'm John Lockwood from John Next Door. I'm lucky enough to have been a guest on Hachanda since day one. I've been working closely with Crafts 2 on the development of the John Next Door brand and also working with their fantastic range of products. I'll be bringing you some fantastic shows that are combining the John Next Door and Crafts 2 products. We'll be sharing things like the press cut dies and some of the Find It Media and some of the other fantastic tools, accessories and other products that Crafts 2 bring to everybody at home. I hope you can join me on my crafting journey and learn some tips and techniques from me that I share with you. So don't miss the Crafts 2 shows with me, John Lockwood, on Hachanda. I'm Jenny Mays from Hobby Art. Hobby Art's a family run company and we've been designing and manufacturing stamps for over 28 years now. We have an extensive range of clear and rubber stamps and we're proud that they're all manufactured in Britain. Whatever your style, there's always something that will interest you with Hobby Art stamps. Crafting is my passion and I love teaching. I love sharing my ideas with other people. This is why I enjoy being part of the Ho-Chanda family, because I have the time to share my ideas, maybe open a door for somebody and give them the confidence to start stamping. So make sure you join me, Jenny Mays, on Ho-Chanda. For good evening, Hachanda. Hey, we're having a party because it's not just me. We've got Haley, we've got Nikki, we've got Snowy, and we've got all the deals. So stay tuned. <laughs> we're having a party. Hello, Hello. Nikki's here. Hello. I'm good, thank you, lovely Hayley. So and how's lovely day Alex. one gone? Yeah. Do you know, it's been fabulous. The presenters have all been lovely. The guests have been great. Everyone is just so nice here. And I get to meet this legend. Yeah, <laughs> Has he given you a massage yet? 
No, oh, does oh. he do that as well? Possibly. Oh, <laughs> snowy. So no, I'm th absolutely over the moon to be here, oh, and everyone oh. has been so nice and welcoming. Well, I know our viewers have been loving yeah. you being here as well. Oh, had some fabulous thanks, feedback, um, and you did a little bit of presenting at one o'clock as well. I didn't did. You? Yes, I didn't know. I thought I was just coming on to say hello and running away, but um, no, I did <laughs> yeah. do a little bit of presenting, yep. and then Anthony actually got me to do a little bit of crafting. Oh, sorry. Did you? Were yes. Well, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> you are, but, uh, for being put on the spot yeah and a novice crafter which is what I say because you know obviously you know you're a crafter in fact the majority of the presenters really now are crafters mm. but I'm a novice crafter but I want to learn yeah you know and I'm excited to learn and I'm excited to learn off you off the guests and also off the viewers the viewers are brilliant they, with regards yeah. to that. honestly yeah, yeah they mm -hmm. really are because so, I was watching the craft along oh, you know, lovely, with, yeah. yeah Catherine and Janice which was hilarious obviously yeah. um, but some of the work that they produced the viewers were just yeah, honestly amazing. amazing. Mm -hmm. I tell you what though, because we, we were having a chat before we came to air, it's dangerous working here. Because Nick, you said to me, are you a crafter then? And I went, I am now. <laughs> I've sold this channel to myself. Yes. So originally I just did my cross stitch and my colouring, but now I pretty much do everything. Craft room, all. So watch this space for yourself. Nikki. Yeah. <laughs> I can see how that would happen. Yeah. Two easily. words of advice: yeah. freedom membership. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Saves you a fortune. <laughs> Who've got on no, Facebook? I don't know actually, because I was just trying to refresh the screen, um, and uh, there was nothing there. Oh, I can't work the scared, so. um, tablet. I just <laughs> don't give me the iPads. I don't know what to do. Oh, sorry, tablets. Yeah. <laughs> You'll get used to that one yeah. as well. <laughs> It'll happen. It'll pop up in a little while. Just take can a you while. fix it? I am guessing that we're going to have some of those familiar favourites here. Heather's going to be here, isn't she? I'm sure. Steve is bound to be there. Yeah. David is going to be there. David actually um, created the chair for our little snow as well. So, yeah. Yeah, Do you want me to pass it to Shana? Um, I think, yeah. I think we're there. Oh, are we? Yeah, because you're oh. on. Look, yeah, I've got the right page now. Oh, Just look, I'm on the telly. Hey. We're on the telly. It's a bit of a delay. <laughs> oh, there we go. We've got everybody there. Beth's there. Sam, Sam's there. Um, Sam oh, as in um, a John Lockwood. Sam. Yeah. Yeah. John, Sam's Sam. been so kind. Sent me a lovely message. Oh, he's yeah. fabulous. Yeah, and we're going to meet up and have a cup of tea, Ooh. stroke alcoholic beverage. <laughs> yeah, so I'm excited that. for that. Yeah. And uh, I get to work with John as well. John Lockwood's next week. Oh, he's week. brilliant. Yeah. Legend. The legend that is. have to say, fun and frolics. He likes that. Oh, okay. Yeah. That sounds quite hard to say. No, it isn't. You'll get used okay. to it. <laughs> Fun and frolics Just with John Just do it before Lockwood. my drink with Sam. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really yeah. Uh, <laughs> now, if you would like to welcome our lovely, lovely brand new presenter here, our lovely Nikki, then please do get in touch. Of course, we've got the tablet here so we can see what you're up to. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you get some interesting chats on here We're as well, don't Very we? interesting. Yeah. They're yeah. all good friends, aren't they, as they well, are, the yeah. regulars. I love the little chat they have between each other and wishing each other a lovely day. And yeah. I'm yeah, like, oh, I want to be part. That's the crafting community. Yeah, yeah it's the crafting lovely. community. Uh, but of course, we are here to do business, aren't we, Alex? Uh, so lovely. No, I'm only joking. Right, so we, we've got some double sided tape here, which I know I go on about this, but if you love your construction or your matting and layering, mm -hmm. this is perfect for. And isn't this it? is your deal of the day, so it's yes. definitely worth going for. Um, and Alex, have you seen this already, Nikki? No, but Alex was just telling me about it and yeah. how useful it is. So. Yeah, yeah. It, it's, it's horrible when you run out and you're in the middle of a project. Mm. So this is why it's good to go for. Now, you've got different sizes. I think the smallest size, oh no, I'm going to have this job, am I, where it's all Aww. good. The smallest size, I think, from memory, because I did this the other day, is three millimetres. It is indeed. Uh, yeah. And it goes all the way up to 25. Are we missing some? That you've got, f oh right, no, five we're not missing each, some. Five uh, each, then, that's two, good. Um, three, four, five, look at all that. Yeah. Yeah. Loads. So good. good. So, yeah, very good price. You've got a £20 saving. Fourteen pounds and fifty pence, good, isn't it? It's brilliant. And our deal of the day is I don't know if anybody's mentioned it to you, Nikki. Launch at seven, seven o'clock every single morning, and you've got twenty-four hours to take advantage of the deal that is on your screen yeah. there. So if you want to take advantage of this and save twenty pounds, you need to be doing it as soon as you possibly can. Um, of course, this is our deal of the day. If you want to take advantage of more than one, there's not an issue at all. And um, there you go, you can see everything there. Now I'm going to bring Nikki with me. We're going to go and have a little one. I'm going to leave Alex with the tablet. So do chat to her. Let us know what you're thinking of our lovely Nikki. I can already see you welcoming her. You're loving her. Um, and so just as we do here as well. But of course, your deal of the day, the details are on your screen there. But it's not the only deal that we've got for you during this hour. Because of course, we've got our sunset specials.
Now, the thing that you need to bear in mind with this hour is these sunset specials that we're bringing to you, and we've got some amazing deals. They're only good at this price up until 8 o'clock, so it's kind of a, like a happy hour kind of deal. And sometimes you've got tremendous savings, savings like that. Have you seen that saving on the screen there? £29 yeah, saving. Yeah, amazing. And I didn't know these were just for an hour, actually, until Emily told me. Yeah, That's brilliant it, yeah. price. Uh, and we do a uh, good morning, Hachanda. That's bright and early at 7 o'clock in the morning. Good evening, Hachanda. And it's a similar sort of idea. So if you do want to jump ahead on the website and have a little look, I don't blame you if you do, because sometimes those deals can sell out before we even get a chance to have a look at them. So we're looking at dyes here. Ooh. Now, have you been learning about dyes at all? Have you had any dye yeah, cutting shows yet? I have, but t you tell me about these okay. ones. Okay, well, these ones are brilliant because they come to us, um, and as you can see there, straight away, you've got your relatives on there, you've got your birthday celebrations, you've got all sorts of elements there, but you've got 20 dyes. This is the key thing. You've got 20 dyes coming to you for £9.97. Now, you'll have noticed on your screen that it says extended delivery with these. We're just talking an extra seven days. And that's usually because we, the stock is coming from overseas, yeah. so it's just to allow for that some extra sentiments. time. Some nice pieces there, yeah. isn't it, as well? Um, and of course, you will need a die cutting machine to work with these, um, but they will work pretty much in any die cutting machine because they're the wafer thin dies. Um, so you can see that they're very thin, so you don't have to worry about which die cutting machine you've got. And the thing that I love about first edition um, dies is I'm going to put those down on the floor because uh, not on the floor on the table <laughs> not on the floor on the table but you also got a magnetic sheet in here as well so instantly you have got somewhere to store those oh, dies and keep them safe um, and to be honest the three magnetic sheets are worth 9.97 in their own right so it's almost like those dies are a bonus amazing is your bathroom tidy and neat? No. Oh, okay. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> no, th this is the thing. I mean, there are some very tidy crafters out there. But well, yeah, I was just thinking that's a lot quite a neat that way, isn't it? Packing it away. <laughs> well, it is. And it is a good way because what you've actually got is you've got the packaging there as well, which means that you could actually have all those little icons perhaps on the back there. So when you're actually crafting, because sometimes when you're crafting in a hurry or you've got bits all over the place, you can misplace elements. So it's a good kind of reference guide to know that you need mm. four dies to yeah. go on that plate there but there you go but um, we're liking those ones lots of people taking advantage of those ones there you go, there you go. rapidly approaching half the stock of these ones so eight wow. two three seven zero seven um you can see there are 20 dies in total for 9.97 brilliant value for money so what have we got here nikki now this washi tape okay so this seems to be all the rage because yeah. so many people have spoken to me about it and said this is what you need obviously these are all gorgeous patterns beautiful they are why as a crafter do we need washi tape so much you can use it in lots of different ways it's self-adhesive to start with so you don't need to apply any glue to these they're already um covered edge to edge coverage so it's kind of like a, a terrible tape so not a terrible tape a terrible <laughs> tape I had that earlier on with my <laughs> Birmingham accent um, and they're printed um, and they're beautiful they're for decorative purposes more than anything okay. so you'd use them perhaps as a, a nice little border and they've almost got that kind of a vellum look to it which is yeah. uh, kind of like a parchment paper that you might have seen with the clarity yes. shows a few moments ago so absolutely beautiful and the thing is with these they're terrible they're not terrible, they're terrible. You can tear them like so. Um, rippable, that's probably a good word. And I know some people do use this to position their dies as they're going through a die cutting machine, but to okay. be honest, I think they're just too pretty to use them. Yeah, I was going to say, that seems a waste, doesn't it? It does, yeah. Um, and they're really pretty designs. You're getting a lot here as well. All yeah. of these for the price on your screen. Wow, so seven I, rolls. Item number 319459. I quite fancy them. I don't know what I'd use them for, but I just think they're gorgeous. <laughs> Welcome to the dark side. Because well, that's I know, what a lot what of Alex us said. Do. Yeah. That's what we'll Alex look said. At, I mean, you can use them in a whole host of different ways. I mean, you've got 10 metres on each of these. So that's 70 metres in total because you've got your seven different designs there. Beautiful florals, I'm sure you'll agree. And they're kind of like a watercolour painting with those. Yeah, so really very nice pretty. effect. Um, it works out it's just 20 pence, or oh, just under 20. 20 pence a metre. That's good value, isn't yeah. it? Beautiful. I told you I should buy them. <laughs> there you go. If you wanted to get a hold of yours, the details are there on your screen. And of course, you can add that into your basket alongside many of those other items we're going to be sharing with you. And we're looking at some 12 by 12 papers next. These are nice and bright, aren't they? I like these. Nice yeah, vibrant colours with these yeah, ones. Yeah, really, really bright. Um, now they're double sided. Yep. So I'll just turn that over as well so you can see if I may. Mm, yeah, go for it. 
these are nice. I like these. They've got nice lines on there. Yeah. So one of the areas that many of our crafters craft in is they do things like journals. Mm. And journals can be, there's a variety of different reasons why people um, do um, journals. It's a bit like a diary, you know, when you're in the teens yeah. and you wrote a diary. Yeah. And it's a similar sort of thing. You might just take a situation that you've been in a day out or just a, a, a moment of mindfulness that you're wanting to jot mm. down your feelings about something. And having those lines on there make it perfect for you to do so. But the other side, I love that print on there. I know, it's great, isn't it? Really, really cool pretty print. design. Um, Mind My Eye with regards to these as well. So, um, a brilliant brand, and you're getting 25 sheets for £11.96. What a good price. That is a good price, <laughs> really is. And if you're making something like a, um, a memory album or something like that, then you'll often have lots of pages. So, having lots of sheets to work with means that you don't have to kind of think, oh, how am I going to be using this? You've yeah. got plenty. Yeah, you've got the space. That's it. And there you go, some details on your screen if you're wanting yours. 641492. So, of course, we're going to work our way along the counter. And oh, pretty bowls. Yeah. These are nice. Really, really nice. Gorgeous colours. Beautiful. Um, now, I just need to say two words to you Anna Griffin. That's it. We love Anna Griffin. Now, have you come across Anna Griffin I with regards to crafting? No. Okay. Well, well known within um, the crafting industry, and she brings some beautiful designs. And every so often, we do get the opportunity to get hold of elements that she's brought to us. Um, and that's what we've got here 100 pre tied bows. This is the key thing. Yeah. Bows can be so tricky. So tricky for nine ninety nine. For nine ninety nine, oh dear. But they're lovely colours as well. That's the key yeah, thing. Yeah, really these. nice colours, and they all kind of go together actually. Yeah. Or you can have them on their own. That pink's a gorgeous Isn't that pink. Beautiful? Yeah, really gorgeous. But you can see when I actually turn this over, it's not like a, a faux bow where it looks like a bow and there's been a bit stuck on the back. Mm. You can actually see where each one of these has been tied to perfection. Um, so you could put these on cards and yeah. Yeah, loads this of is this colour here is ideal for. I want to say christenings, weddings, nice. engagement, isn't it? It's quite sophisticated, Classic. really, particularly if it's put with an ivory as mm -hmm. well. So we've got that colour there. Yeah. The green works with that one as well, I think, because yeah, they're kind of similar sort of tones, aren't they? Nice. Yeah, and is. this blue is very pretty, obviously for a boy or christening of a boy or new yeah, baby yeah. or if you're just a big fan of blue, absolutely stunning, like a nice. powdery blue. That's it. Now, if you're wanting to go for more than one set of these, you can do It's not limited to one per customer. Um, we have been very busy with these and already half the stock has gone. Wow. 100 pieces in total, 9 99 If you're wanting to get hold of yours, 584763. Ooh, now, envelopes. Yes. Always useful. And a lot of them. There's a lot of them, <laughs> there is. Um, it's good size as well, C5. Um, C5 um, is a half of an A4 sheet. So, um, and when it becomes an envelope, we change the A to a C for some reason. I've got no idea why. It's one of life's mysteries. But so, so when you you'll, you'll get familiar with the different things that pop up on the screen. So if this was a um, if this was cardstock, you'd probably see um, A5 on there. Mm. But because they're envelope, envelopes, they're C5. So they're 120 envelopes. GSM, and they're pearlized, aren't they? If I That's can pick it. one yeah. up, yeah. Uh, give it a wiggle. Yeah. If we have uh, a look at this, you can probably see. And that, that is beautiful. Gives it that professional look with these. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous look at that you can see just that yeah. little bit of shimmer there that also shows up even more if you're putting them through um, a die cutting machine and perhaps embossing and the gsm relates to the actual weight of them and yes. again you, you may well have picked yeah. up some of these things already look inside as well sorry just to notice that oh so, yeah. nice lovely that's always nice as well isn't it when you open and up. you know that you've got something nice inside an envelope when it's arrived like that yeah you do <laughs> posh invitations on it well that's it you've got 200 there so they could be invites for a wedding quite easily and at 12 pounds very affordable too mm, absolutely so item number 068557 that's it so if you want to pop those into your basket then by all means do check out those other deals we're still very busy for that washi tape and of course those lovely bows will look perfect on your invitation so it might be a nice addition to that set back round to dice again yeah now spellbinders is another company that well known within the industry yeah i know you spellbinders, must have yes. spellbinders yeah um and these are lovely i mean the designs that you've got here we've got Mor moroccan um, motifs and accents as well which is cool, nice. aren't they? Very, they are. very cool. They're beautiful. Yeah. Um, and quite often with spellbinders, you'll see the same name appear on different collections because they'll have certain elements, they'll have motifs, they'll have accents, they might have borders. Um, and we're fortunate enough to have two elements from the same collection in this set. Brilliant. Have you seen that price? Yeah, I know. Have I you know seen that saving? 
saving of £72.81. Uh -huh. pence. Yeah, <laughs> that is a huge discounted price. But of course, you've only got 45 minutes to take advantage of these. And, the and these binders. are brilliant, absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to turn one of these round just so you can have a little look. Because on the packaging, quite often what you will find with the packaging is because there's so much information that needs to be fitted onto the packaging, then the dies themselves are way larger than the image shows. And especially that one, that's huge. That is huge, yeah. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah, 20 dies. 20 yeah, dies for 9 binders. Yeah. Brilliant. Gorgeous designs there. Um, if you're wanting these ones, it's 768223 that all important item number and of course spellbinders being the name you know that you're buying into quality with regards to these ones and so uh, why not pop those into your basket now mdf mdf baubles in fact yeah now i've seen some people some guests do some brilliant things with these actually over the past sort of few weeks looking at the shows what would you use these for? Yes. Well, um, instantly you look at them and you do think that they are like Christmas baubles, don't you? So absolutely beautiful designs, as you can see here. They've all got the little hole on there as well. So these are fabulous for you to just literally take a little bit of wire, hang them onto your tree, um, and away you go. But I think of these baubles being really good fundraisers. So quite often, my kids, I know you've got Dylan, I'm only six yeah. years old, crafting at school, on the run up to Christmas, these are brilliant because the kids could actually decorate these um, in the classroom mm. and then maybe sell them at a Christmas craft fair or something like yeah. that. Because I don't know about you, you can't walk past something that Dylan's made, I'm sure. Yeah. I certainly couldn't. And it was double Definitely. for me. I've got twins. So yeah, yeah of course. Um, so these would be brilliant as a fundraiser. So just decorations, do you think you could use them on a card? or You could do, they're yeah. lightweight enough yeah um, but there's something that you could actually make baby's first Christmas maybe you could personalize oh, those how gorgeous. and that could yeah, be something that comes yeah, out every lovely. single year or kids making um, little baubles to give as gifts um, for all their family members and then each year they can come out um, a friend of mine she uh, she doesn't give Christmas cards what she does is she makes a Christmas bauble instead and she gives lots of baubles to people so oh, and she puts idea. the year on the back of them so you've got kind of like a collection of baubles what a nice yeah. idea yeah, like that mm -hmm. um and uh, you can use all sorts with these yeah glitter fate snow you could indeed mm. yeah uh, or maybe just some papers if you wanted to just get some adhesive on there put those gorgeous papers on sand the edges off lots of ideas like that one <laughs> um, details on your screen there, so 541600, £9.99 and 99 pence if you're wanting to take advantage of those. A um, couple more things, oh, per lesson card, these this are going to go with those envelopes, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, this is so nice, saw this earlier. Oh, gorgeous. Now, a whole array of different colours. You've got different sizes with regards to these pieces as well. And again, these are something that when you actually hold them um, to the camera, I mean, you've got that gorgeous um, look with that, the shimmer and shine with these, beautiful. Yeah. Let's have a look. So pretty. Aren't they gorgeous? Yeah, so pretty. Nice thing with these is they're double sided as well. So, so it's kind of getting the... twice the amount of sparkle. Yeah, <laughs> so look at that. That's the kind of gold. There we go. Just catching the light there. That's the gorgeous gold. Beautiful. Yeah, really, really beautiful. And then beautiful. if you flip it over, you'll be able to see that it's on both sides as well. <gasps> Lovely. Isn't that gorgeous. Beautiful. And sometimes if you give it a bit of a tear, Card can, um, some card is coloured right the way through. Sometimes it's a white core, mm. so when you tear it, it just depends um, how it goes. So if I actually tear that, can you see how you've still got the same colour there running through? So that means that if you want to take something like an ink pad, you could actually brush the ink pad against oh, there. Yes. But sometimes it's white, um, not always, I just chuckling to ourselves. We've got a flamingo between us here. I love <laughs> Getting its moments. Yeah, look at this Aww. flamingo there. Oh, making yeah. an appearance um but loads of different colors in there as well They're gorgeous, yeah aren't really they? good and again like you said the two sizes so 150 by 300 millimeters and then 105 by 210 millimeters and there's 200 sheets in total and, and that's nice because the larger pieces when you fold them down there you go you can see got a nice little card base do you want to hang on to that yeah, one Nicky? Thank you. um and similarly with the smaller ones if you want to make smaller cards little notelets or small christmas cards yes. kids christmas cards would be perfect, perfect like yeah that, they? perfect love those um if you're wanting to get a hold of them you're getting 200 sheets for just 11 pounds and 90 p these prices are good aren't they they are but mm. that's what happens in good evening yeah yeah so i'm realizing <laughs> <laughs> so yeah if you want to take advantage of those do pop them into your basket and again if you want to go for more than one set please do so but make sure you check out your basket as soon as you can because you could miss out on those if you're not quick now, oh my goodness, be crafty. Now, the be crafty girls, you'll get to meet them. We always have a hoot, they're fabulous. <laughs> um, but um, with these ones, oh, we might not be able to talk about them much. Oh. They've already sold out. Sell They've out. gone. 
This is why we urge people to have a little look yeah, on the website and see. jump ahead. Mm. Mm. Never learning. mind. Aww. You've missed out. Well, they were very nice. They were, <laughs> while they lasted. Yeah. <laughs> so what should we look at next then, Nikki? So we're going to go, aren't we going to go to... I think um, I'm going to jump onto the website because we're going to have a little chat okay. with our lovely Maria because Maria has come in to have a chat about the one day special. Um, and the one day special, I was fortunate enough to launch with her, well, so just over an hour and 20 minutes ago. So uh, on the website, you'll find all the details, not only of our one day special, all of our fabulous sunset day, um, specials as well, but um, of course, loads of different goodies on there. Um, so, uh, yeah, if you're wanting to take advantage of any of those deals, do pop them into your basket. But, of course, as I said, 6 o'clock every evening, we do launch a one-day special. We've got the lovely Maria here to tell us more about it and to share the different stamps that you're getting with our lovely Alex. So here's your one-day special. Yes, it's a little hint of the one-day mm -hmm. special. Hello, good evening, Hello. Maria. <laughs> you had a very busy hour, didn't you? It was you? very busy, yeah. It's nice. Great. Now, are these new today, our they fantastic are absolutely stamps? absolutely brand spanking new today. Lovely. Yes. Uh, should we have a little look? Do you want to talk yes. through them for us? Uh, what okay, got? so what we've got here is four beautiful sets mm -hmm. of branch stamps. So these right. were designed by Mel Turner, our in-house designer. Yep. Um, and they, so in each of the sets, we've got beautiful sentiment and a beautiful fond, and we've got a, you know a frond a different frond I like that and word. then we've got little offshoots as well so we can use yeah. those to uh, pattern build or to extend uh, the frond and then we've got the little elements there as well they're really diddy tiny little stamps and what those are for we've got the outline mm -hmm. and then we've got the infill as well so yeah. we can color them as well and you can just do your own pattern building you know small stamps are just very very fun right. um, so these are really lovely Lovely, like compendium of, of stamps also although these are Christmas stamps mm -hmm. I think really if you take away that the words Christmas from there and the Christmas sentiments I think these can be all year round yeah, you know, Holly's lovely Ivy you know the berries there that could be you know it's whatever you want it to be the beautiful naked um, branch there as well they're just very very cool and, and great fun to use yeah beautiful and you've got some absolutely glorious Mm -hmm. samples. Do you want to talk us through the samples Yeah, so this too? is Dee. So lovely. Dee has started off with some of our uh, toffee apple paper there. Mm. And then you can see the shimmer there, can't you, down the side. So this is the ivy. Um, so down the sides, Dee's actually used the large frond. And then on the acrylic shapes in the middle, there's a square one and then there's a the bauble. But can you see the solid ivy shapes there, yeah. glittering gold? So that's one of those tiny, tiny little stamps as well. Um, so just really lovely piece, mm, really beautiful. nice, substantial looking. Who's done this one? Clean and simple. Yeah. This is Linda Spencer, really nice. Um, so she's gone down the, um, so is this, was this rose hip? I, I can't decide, is it rose hip or is it uh, the like mistletoe-y? I know uh, it's, it's whatever we want, uh, but yes. it's one of those, isn't it? It's got those beautiful coloured sort of berries on them. Uh, it's just really nice. Well, I know nice. mistletoe's white, isn't it? Yeah, yeah that's what I'm thinking, but ones. then there's the, the leaves as well. So um, mm. yeah, but the, they're, they're beautiful beautiful anyway yeah. so really nice answers on a postcard if you yes. know your flowers and whatnot because <laughs> I enjoy looking at them I have no idea of the no, names. No and I'm not very good at looking <laughs> after them either to be honest. Uh, so this one is from Elaine this is really lovely so again Elaine started with our design paper and then she's done some uh, stamping she's built you know like a little branch uh, for the for the baubles to hang from and then she's actually stamped the the holly onto the the little baubles as well because we've got those those are also brand new today as well well acrylic mm. baubles and yeah. mini shapes oh so cool mm -hmm. yeah i'm looking forward to seeing those yeah and then this is more. from sarah now this again very very cool sarah's actually taken one tiny little element there and she's actually built up that really lovely wreath wow um, yeah there you go can you see in the middle you've got the little one with the, the three berries yeah that is the stamp there that that, that has been created used to create the, the lovely wreath a little bit of color in beautiful and has she embossed it she must have an ink then that's got a really yeah. nice um I open time. I think that, uh, yeah, Versamark, uh, yeah. Sarah's oh, probably okay. used Versamark and she's gold embossed that. So, uh, yeah, yeah, isn't that lovely? That is beautiful. So let's go to the one day special once more. You're getting these gorgeous four stamp mm -hmm. sets 
for £24.99. pence. Oh yes, I must say, you will get a, a bonus gift as well. Yes, and it is well worth having. Can you so, tell me what it is? I don't yes, know. so what we've got is both. You don't have to choose here. Yeah. We've got the pack of 10 uh, Barb's favourite <gasps> uh, parchment. That's a good gift, yeah. Yeah, okay. Or, and we've also <laughs> got the pack of 10 Bob's favourite designer paper as well. But you do get both. Wow, that yeah. is a really good gift, isn't it? That is while stocks last, I must say. So you need to do sort of um, you need it's first come first serve so you do need to order if you want to make sure you're going to get that bonus gift but coming back to your one day special just 24 pounds and 99 pence item number is nine six no seven nine six <laughs> four seven floor four seven floor <laughs> four seven long floor day, it has it, it has <laughs> Oh, uh, sorry, Snowy. <laughs> right then, <laughs> all you need to do is give us a call 01733602000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. Maria, thank you. Thank I will you. see you in half an hour. Indeed. Yeah. But now it's time for your All Stars. It is indeed, and I'm the fortunate person to tell you all about them. We have had some amazing shows today. We have just picked out a couple of items to share with you, but of course what you can do is go through all those different th shows that we've got on Rewind and see all the different opportunities for you to revisit those shows and take advantage of some of those fabulous items. So what should we start with? I'm going to start with Trisha. I was thinking, Trisha? Trisha's not here. Oh, her kitties. Now, I didn't get to do one of Trisha's shows today, unfortunately, but she has left a beautiful mat here. Look at this. This is a beautiful design. And here you can see all the elements that you need are going to be included within this kit. So you've got your gorgeous strips, all pre-cut, so you don't need to worry about those. They are all there. Your pink tones, your blue tones, and then, of course, you have got your calico or your cotton fabric that's going to be working alongside that, as you can see there. And you've also got your wadding. Now, you've got everything that you need within this kit, including your full instructions. And this is the beauty. Because Trisha is such a fabulous teacher, she has laid out the simplest of instructions with full photos so you're not left on your own at all. Of course, you can go back and watch the show. Um, and you can go back for up to 60 days now with Rewind. So you can get your kit and then you can actually craft alongside and pause and then continue and revisit areas if you wanted to. Of course, what um, Trisha is showing you here is the fabric requirements all the way through there. So, of course, if you do want to add in your own fabrics or make, remake this with your own fabrics, then you can do. Trisha was here twice today. So she was here at 11 o'clock this morning um, and also 2 o'clock this afternoon. Two fabulous shows, so do make sure you go back and watch on Rewind. But if you don't get the opportunity, then rest assured, everything that you need to know is within this kit. All you need to do is to add in a little bit of sewing, add a little bit of thread in there, and then there you go. You can make yourself a fabulous mat for your sewing machine to sit on, which is brilliant because it can kind of deaden the sound, so it makes it nice and easy for you to sew on. And it might stop vibrations if you find that you're chasing your sewing machine across the table as it sews. This is what you need. 253898 and beautiful fabrics as you can see there for just £24.99. Get that one in your basket for certain. Now, did you catch one of Lou's shows earlier on? Oh, she did two shows. I was with her at 12 o'clock. Yanis was with her at 4 o'clock. And she bought us, again, we've not seen this since about May time. Might have even been prior to that. The Therma Works White Moth. And this is incredible. Fabulous show, do go back and watch because what you've got within this pack is you've got all those fellow, fellow, little tiny elements, they're little tiny balls as you can see, they're little pellets that will melt down. Now the white morph needs to be melted at a higher temperature. Anything over 62 degrees is going to allow you to melt this down. And what it will do is give you something that's very pliable with regards to um, what you're going to use it for. Um, you can use it for all sorts. You can make, um, put it into the mould, things like um, your Katie Sue moulds, you can put them in there. You can make it into something like a handle. Maybe if you've got something like a screwdriver or something where the handle is a little bit small for your grip, then you can make a new handle to go on these. Finger grips with your own pencils and things like that. Loads of ideas. And the beauty is then if you're not happy with it or you want to change it, just throw it back into the saucepan and it will re-melt and then you can mould and reuse it over and over again. Now one of the most popular ways for you to get hold of this was um, with a 9 purchase as you can see there. And you're getting um, 250 grams. So we're 
other size packs as well the one kilogram pack i know was popular as well as the half kilogram and we also had the cool morph available now the cool morph works in a similar way as in those pellets will melt but a lower temperature so if you don't want to get boiling water involved and you fancy using something like a hair dryer or maybe a radiator or even sunlight then you can actually get hold of that cool morph and the cool morph is brilliant for you to have in your, your pocket maybe make yourself like a little ball of it or a, almost like a credit card made of it because if you're out and about and something happens and you're wanting to fix something instantly then all you need to do is perhaps pop to the local supermarket pop it under one of those hand dryers and the heat from the hand dryer will actually make it malleable again and then away you go people may wonder what you're up to in there but um, if you're wanting your white morph then the details are there on your screen as you can see 892 859 if you're wanting to get hold of those now we've been busy with the deal of the day during this hour as well and it's not surprising when you see what you are going to be getting with this you've got all sorts in there so you've got your craft tape you've got your tear tape or your rippable tape there um, you've got five reels of those that are going from three mil six mil nine mil twelve mil through to twenty five mil same dimensions with regard to your red um, and now with your white you've got 50 meters i think it is on each of those whereas with your red you've got five meters all coming together for just 14 pounds and 50 pence whopping great saving of 20 pounds but of course it's another time for us to revisit our sunset specials yes nikki's still here i'm still here uh, yes, and we're back with our sunset specials, but must reiterate to you at home that they will be going up in half an hour, so you only get that hour window. Yeah. We've just been gossiping, haven't we, about yeah. dyes and die cutting machines. Yeah. So I've <laughs> they heard upstairs we were being a bit loud. Yeah, sorry, it wasn't we were just, me. No, it was it's me. Alex. Yeah, I've got a bass voice. That's what it is. It's travels. Yeah, I wouldn't travels. talk like that. So unprofessional. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't me. It wasn't me. Um, but yeah, obviously these are great. We've yeah. been talking about everything that you're collecting, and I'm probably soon to be collecting. Moira, I think it was Moira, commented on Facebook saying, "Nikki, if you think you've got tons of makeup, you're gonna have a ton of craft stuff." <laughs> I'm so excited about it though, honestly. Because yeah. you were saying you're a little boy crafts too. Yeah, yeah, well that's who actually got me into it because I think at a young age they're starting, they're starting at school, mm. things like these cakes that, that you know that are produced at birthday parties, invitations, thank you cards, etc. Yeah. Everything is handcrafted now. Mm. And it's not just basic level, you know, they are extraordinary. And I thought, I'm missing out here. I'm yeah. the only mum that's getting shop-bought cake, shop-bought invitations. I need to up my game yeah. here. So that's when me and Dylan started to craft. But I am a novice crafter. But, you know, it's so exciting yeah. to think of all of this that I've got to learn. Yes, I know the basics, mm -hmm. but I can't wait to learn more from you guys and the guests and um, obviously yeah. the viewers and everything. So, yeah, I've just been chatting about which dye machine, coke machine to get. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but also, again, when we were... When the channel first launched, as you know, I, I only did the cross stitch and colouring. And I remember being, because I got the job and we were literally thrown on air, literally. And, um, and I remember chatting to Julia Watts for our first show. And she said, all right, so you've got your dyes. And I said, what on earth is a dye? I learned live on air. Yeah. So. And, and you at home are all supportive. I know you're going to be really supportive of Nikki. So. Yes. Aww, thank you. You get some lovely comments. Oh, all right, I'll do my job. We'll do my job. Right. <laughs> um, right, dyes. Now, these are your first edition dies, and you're getting three sets. You've got your uh, sentiments. You can never have too many happy birthday sentiments, Nikki. Yeah, I was, yeah I'm learning that, yeah. definitely. Mm. Um, celebrate all of those with love. Yay! Uh, and then we've also got one for the gentleman. I know, perfect. Yeah, I saw those earlier and thought they were great. And then also we're getting the backing, aren't we, now, which is what um, Hayley was showing us earlier. Yeah, this is nice because you don't always get them with dies, but you've got the magnetic sheets for your storage because if you don't have your storage, I've, I, all of my dies are on mag magnetic sheets. Are um, you quite neat and tidy then in your craft room? No. Because I feel this would be used <laughs> if you were a neat and tidy crafter. Well, okay, I would say I'm 50-50. Okay. So I, I have got organisation and then I've got mess. It's, that's kind of Whereas what it Hayley is. Whereas Hayley said hers is just mess. Yeah, organised chaos, organised mess. Yeah, um, but but these are fantastic for your storage. So it's nice that you're not sort of having to buy those separately. Yeah. Yeah. So these are your lovely dies. 
Uh, uh, so, great deal, eh? Yeah, it is. And item number, if you want this deal, is 823707. So the price, just for this hour, remember, is £9.97 and 295p and p Now, that is on extended delivery seven days but you can only get that offer until the end of the hour lovely 20 dies for that price washi tape i'm going to be honest with you because i know you're saying oh this is all the rage yeah i haven't got into washi tape oh. i have well it's all the rage it's all the rage <laughs> <laughs> um but no, very seriously useful. that's all like that's probably what i've heard the most mm -hmm since being here about from different guests and yeah. viewers is this washi tape so I was thinking what is washi tape I obviously need some in my life you do it's <laughs> not that I, I don't know what to do with it I need some washi tape it's not that I won't get into it it's just that I keep buying everything else this is what I mean now your washi tape is um, a lot of people are using it in their journals yes and their scrapbooks and it's just it's a, just a lovely um, thing to um, not elaborate you know decorate, decorate your pages yeah. and a lot of them as you can see they've got lovely patterns haven't they Nikki yeah really Really, really pretty, all of them actually, and such a good deal there. So, mm -hmm. thirteen ninety nine plus your P and P. Um, so the price you're saving is fourteen pound. Item number three one nine four five nine. And as I said, this is all the rage. You know, if you want to be down with the kids, this washi tape is exactly what you need. Oh, one ninety nine a roll. Emily said. Oh, fabulous. Very good. You're going to get much like me and be like, yes. Yeah, yeah he said. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, we've got some uh, lovely cardstock. See, so you could use your washi tape with the cardstock yeah. in so your scrapbooking. Yeah, double-sided. This is really nice, actually. Me and Hayley were admiring this. Look, this one goes perfectly with this, I think. What? Hey, what's Hayley doing? What? <laughs> I'm nicking it. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, they're all chuckling I'll at just me. Just take this with me. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you've got twenty-five sheets, double-sided, uh, twelve by twelve, but. They're a really nice uh, weight of cardstock mm. as well. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Item number is 641492. So that's 1196 annual postage. And you're saving £14.60 on that. Again, only until the top of the hour. Uh, acid and lignin free too, which is really good, obviously. And uh, now next up, that shouldn't be in shot. Nothing, there was nothing there. <laughs> I was telling you I'm sticky note green. Yes. What a title. She leaves a trail where she's been, apparently. Yes. yes. <laughs> That's where Alex is. Do you like it? Do you like bows? Do you also yeah, like I them do. on clothing? Yeah, things? I do. Absolutely love bows. And I love the colour. And I think there's so much that can be done with these colours. So we were saying this pink is beautiful. This gold, though, I feel would probably go with the most for maybe wedding cards, mm. congratulations, anniversary, and perhaps these two together as well. Because, of course, the ivory looks absolutely gorgeous with that gold. Yes, it tones well, doesn't it? And I've learned that Anna Griffin is obviously a big name. Yep. Thanks to Hayley. So brilliant price again. So the price is £9.99 yeah. plus your PMP. You're saving £10. You're getting a hundred pieces in total. Item number 584. Ooh. 763 and over 80 percent has already sold out it's because they're too good a deal yeah, and definitely. lovely prices and it, it is nice sometimes to pop a, a little bow on your card just to finish it off i think yeah definitely do you want to give this a wiggle oh yeah. we'll sorry well you can give it a wiggle in a second sorry 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 webster sorry webster <laughs> i'm gonna um give it a wiggle because this is absolutely beautiful so it's pearlized mm -hmm. Hopefully you're going to see this if I wiggle correctly. <laughs> um, and what's nice is as well, you're going to see it. Oh, that's lovely. See the pearlescence, it's yeah, gorgeous, isn't it? absolutely beautiful. And when you open the envelope up as well, it is inside, which I always think looks really nice. Oh, Janice and I were saying that means it's not just posh, yeah, it's can I, so posh. Well, yeah, I was going to say, you can see it obviously inside, so you know that you're either sending a posh invitation mm. or you're receiving one, so that's nice. Yeah, I like that. You could even decorate I can't it. guarantee you're going to get a posh invitation, by the way, so don't go <laughs> buying them thinking, oh, Nikki said I'm going to get a posh invitation somewhere. I can't guarantee that. I but like it. Beautiful envelope. Yes indeed uh, and how many are we getting 200 200 of your envelopes so item number there 068557 so your price is 12 pound plus postage and packaging yep. and you are saving 18 pound on that deal lovely oh six pence per envelope very very oh, nice indeed you can't beat this now uh, Spellbinders as well is another brand that's yes, really quite well which known. Which I'm aware of, yes. yeah. And they do the most gorgeous, ornate, decorative dyes um, from large to small, but they're always something, they're always a little bit different, I think, and quite elegant, actually. I think Spellbinders comes along with an elegance. 
Yeah, and these are, we're just going to turn them around because as we discovered when I was here with Hayley, um, they're really, really quite a good size, yeah. aren't they? Let's turn that one around as well. Lovely. Yeah, Some of them fell off. <laughs> a really, really good size that you've got there. Check that out. That, oh, sorry, wrong, I'm pointing at the wrong bit. This is great for your borders. That is wonderful. But there are all sorts of different shapes, like you've got your corner there. You could pop it. Well, if you had a tiny sentiment, you could pop it in here. But that, that could just literally make a card. And well, it's going to tell you this, yeah. the saving on this it's is mad. £72.81. Please That's don't miss saving. out on that. Because, so nine yeah. ninety nine is your total, your postage and packaging as well, and that is your saving, item number 768223. Does this work out then, if there's 20 dies, although my maths is rubbish, like 50 pence per die? Is that about right? Is that right? 20 dies? Yeah. Yeah, we, we, I, think, I think it's like I about 50 pence. I can't do it in pence. my head. Lovely. I was right. Hooray, bit of maths, which was really easy. Oh, worrying. <laughs> ah, MDF, MDF. Yeah, lovely. So Hayley was saying earlier as well, great for decorations, maybe for your kids to do, decorate for Christmas. I thought it might be a nice idea to put it onto a card as yeah. well. Um, I imagine, what can, what can you, what paint can you use with this? What can you put on the top of it? MDF is excellent. It is a medium that will take so many things. So... Uh, all of your paints, like your acrylics, yeah. all of that, you can ink onto them. Uh, you can uh, stamp and emboss onto them. <gasps> Have you seen embossing yet? No, not yet. Okay, so you know what I said? Like I, I've, I've got hooked. Yeah. Embossing was what got me hooked. Ah, okay. okay. So there are two types of embossing. There's heat embossing, and that's the embossing that got me hooked. Nikki, it's magic. It is. It's magic, you isn't it? You have to show me. Okay. Well, no, it's because it is. They're saying, calm down, Alex. <laughs> You'll be with a guest that will do it. Uh, oh, my gosh, especially... What, what other days are you in or you're not sure yet? Tu yeah, no, I'm in on Tuesday, Wednesday. Oh, I've got John Lockwood. Right, he'll probably do some embossing. John and Sam, if you're watching... <laughs> Can you show Nikki embossing? That would be awesome. Oh, that would be amazing. Yeah, yeah. I've got them Tuesday. And you have to say fun and frolics. This fun is a frolics. thing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> right, so <clears throat> lovely MDF. It will take all of your mediums. Uh, nine, oh, sorry, yeah, you're going to do that bit, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so item number 541600, and the price is just 9 99 mm -hmm. again, plus your postage and packaging, and you are saving £10. All right, five of each design. Lovely. Now, this is really nice cardstock, Nikki. Really nice and glittery. And can I do a, sh a shimmer? Yes, or a wiggle, you can. Whatever the technical term is. So if we have a look at this. Isn't that oh, stunning? Yeah. See, Nikki, also, there's lots of technical terms. So wiggling cardstock. Wiggling, yeah. Stroking fabric. Oh, okay. Stroking, stroking. fabric. Uh, when I'm on with Hayley Smith, who does from Craft Yourself Silly, we do lots of wafting. There's that oh, that goes okay. on. Synchronised wafting. We'll get you into all of oh, this. Synchronised wafting. Oh, yes. There's a lot to learn here. <laughs> <isn't there? laughs> a lot to learn. Uh, but it's beautiful cardstock. The colours are so elegant, wouldn't you say? Yeah, absolutely. There's two different sizes as well. 150 mm. by 300 millimetres. And then you've got 105 by 210 millimetres. 200 sheets in total that you're mm. getting. Item number 877978. The price is just £11.90. Plus your PMP, your saving is £23 in this hour on that. Lovely. Now, Freedom, if you're not yet a Freedom member, and we've told you about that. Yes. Become a Freedom member. Yeah. Um, <laughs> because On it. Yeah, on it, because if you start buying, uh, well, I won't tell you. Who's, who's going to tell us? Ah, now, right, listen. This is, so Janice is going to do it. But is it Janice? That, well, here we go. So I'm going to say the first line, and then, and then we'll go. Okay, ready? Hello, everyone. Webster! Hello everyone, I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Hochanda Freedom. Did you know that with Hochanda Freedom you could be saving on your deliveries every single month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee, you'll benefit from unlimited standard delivery, which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And do you know the best bit? You can cancel at any time. Becoming a member of Hochanda Freedom, you'll also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom Members discounts, where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hochanda price. Freedom Members will also receive our exclusive Members Badge and Freedom Newsletter, which will keep you updated with all the goings-on behind the scenes. Look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month.
Over 12,000 of you are already members, and we thank you so much for being part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hochanda Freedom. I'm a Freedom member, which means I can shop a lot. It's the discounts and all the special offers you get. I get special offers, I get special discounts. They tell me when everything's happening. So if there's a special show I want to watch, then it's there. So I'm able to just shop when I'd like. It's just good to have. But yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. <laughs> you see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website, quoting the item number 888888. So don't forget you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, members badge and members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hochanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hochanda family. So there you go, Freedom. It's grown by one. Because it's yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. You definitely. Up. Yeah, but you and Janice do sound very similar on that. Don't we? Hello, Absolutely. everyone. Absolutely. Yeah. We've been having <laughs> such good fun playing that. game. Have you heard about the Alex and Janice game? No. Okay. So, basically, okay. What day was it? Uh, it was about a week ago. I went into the presenters' lounge and I, I, I went in and I went, oh, "Why are we on repeat?" Because I thought it was me and it was Janice. Later on, I was working with Janice um, on Good Evening Hachanda. And she just randomly brought up, do you know, I was in the studio the other day and um, they said they were throwing to the Freedom VT and said it was me. Uh, but then you came on and I thought, I sound exactly like you. <laughs> so what we've started doing is just playing the hello everyone without being able to see on screen and asking you at home, oh. is it Alex or Janice? Oh, I it's see. It's really good. Oh, I like this It's yeah, really it's good, hard like, actually. It's a yeah. hard one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, what, are you going to do it, Webster? Hello everyone. I've got a minute or two to tell no, you. No, you only have to. You, you can Alex. only do the hello, everyone. Webster, get with the program. Oh, it's still Alex. <laughs> hello, everyone. I've got Janice. You're not quick on the button. He's not quick at anything. To <laughs> there you go. The he's not going to. He's not going to give us any stings now at all. <laughs> As he left, we've got no camera moves. That's it. <laughs> no, we'll play it another. I was saying though, we might have to give it a little bit of a rest because I think everybody at home is like just started oh, to yeah. suss it out. You sound yeah. very all the members of the Chanda Freedom. <laughs> Did you know that with the Chanda Freedom, you could be saving on your deliveries? <coughs> if my other half's watching, he'll be he'll be like, "What the heck is going on?" Lewis <laughs> <laughs> has just said that's Alex after a night out. <laughs> I mean, heck, that's some night out. Oh, that was funny. Oh dear me. Oh dear me. Oh, are we going to? Are you going to tell us about what whatever this teacup challenge is? Well, I've been off taking little photos yeah. on the tablet while you guys were talking about the sunset specials, yeah. and the, the tablet's just died power oh, okay. so oh, it's just charging up. Yeah. But, so, yeah, we'll have a little look at about that little. I want to see. Nice. Yeah, took a few photos, but yeah, we've got our deal of the day. Yes. So as you've been finding out, this important stuff yeah deal of the day <laughs> tell me more uh well it's just all really good for your matting and layering basically if you don't want things to fall apart in five seconds <laughs> because it's super super strong right and sometimes with glue sometimes with glue it's oh yes we must do that sorry i'm just chatting i'm just dancing emily back but sometimes with glue over time you know if there's central heating and years and years and years you know go by things, things dry out, yeah, yeah. basically but this stuff is super strong and especially if you're making a nice gift box you don't want it to fall apart when you've given it to, to somebody so. so is this really an essential oh, yes yeah. right okay yeah in box falls that's ah. why when you've got a deal like this on your screen it's worth it going for several of them okay mm -hmm. oh, i've got so much to buy <laughs> yes so much to buy and catherine is also another one that's upstairs every two minutes yeah. buying stuff mm -hmm. yeah in she fact she's lovely she's so oh, helpful. she's a gourd, isn't she? Yeah. But she's passed me in how much she's buying. That's because I've started to get really cheeky and ask for free stuff. <laughs> Deflecto Sam, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> you haven't met Deflecto Sam yet, have yeah. you? Oh, we'll get all the storage. Of your storage. Yes. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so glad I got to meet Snowy. Yes. Yeah. Um, I know, look fabulous. But no one really knows why he's here or where he's come from. But well, he's I'm, just here. I, I get, I've got a little bit of a backstory because Ali, Ali um, Higginbottom, who you'll get to meet because she's got a fabulous company that comes to us here at the Chanda, Ali's Stitchy Fingers. Yeah, I've seen she, the show. Um, she created um, the little bear. 
there. But he's got a different name, and I can't remember what she said his name was. Uh, I can't think what it is. No, I don't. I don't think it was a Christian name. I think it was something like. Um, Oh, I can't remember what it was. No, it wasn't that <laughs> at all. But we decided that um, Snowy, followed yeah. by the second name. Ali, if you're watching, um, do let us know. I'd look on the tablet, but we've run out of power, so I can't check. Yeah. Yeah. But it, it's something like um, so cute. Macintosh or something like that. It was a, diff it was a name yeah. that was more of a surname than a Christian yeah. name. And so we decided that his name was, he got a full name. But yeah, Aww. this is Snowy. Um, and then who threads. made this? This is his birthday suit. That was Hayley <laughs> Smith. Yeah, Aww. Hayley Smith. Which is interesting because a birthday suit usually it doesn't Include any clothes, yeah. is it? But there you go. We will not occasion. be. We have not passed the watershed. Snowy is not yeah. taking his That's clothes it. off. He's got a birthday cake tummy though, hasn't he? He's uh, had yeah. a few slices of that birthday oh, there's been cake. A lot to, oh, did you hear the story about Yanis in the buffet? No. Oh, go on, tell it. This is oh, hilarious. Is so funny. So this morning, the, obviously because it's birthday, everyone's gone out, spent money, bought in bits and pieces of food and drink, and there's this beautiful buffet laid on. But the buffet was going to open at a certain time, which Yanis didn't know. So this morning, Yanis went to the buffet, yeah. got a plate, loaded up, out he went. Unbeknown to, to him, everyone in the office was looking at him thinking, well, we haven't opened the buffet yet, Yanis. <gasps> he hasn't contributed. And you're, yeah, you're just tucking in, but oh, it's Yanis, so okay. So off he goes and eats his buffet. Then he comes back for round two. Still, the buffet is not officially open, so Yanis is obviously piling up. His, as he said, all oh, that cake looks good. Every rocky road, you know, he's off with his second plate, and off he goes in. And then we come to prep yeah. with Sandro, the producer and director. And Yanis said, "This rocky road is really good." To which Sandro replied, "Oh, the buffet actually hasn't been opened yet, Yanis." And Yanis went, oh, you're kidding. And he went, no. And he said, because Sandro said, oh, we've all bought something in. And Yanis went, what, we were all meant to bring in food as well? <laughs> Sandro went, yeah. So he said, what, so I've got to eat it before it's even open. And I was meant to contribute. And they all went, yeah. And he said, I'm so sorry. He went around the whole uh, office, didn't so he? So the whole office were literally watching Yanis piling his plate, having brought yeah. nothing in for anyone else, <laughs> and then coming back for round two. <laughs> <laughs> Love Red it. Thing. Oh, the oh, antics that go on here. So oh, funny. Dear, I, I think don't we know. Have. <laughs> oh, it's only on 4%. Oh, we oh, okay. go straight in and look at the photos. Yes, oh, where do we chat. go from there? Because with the photos, we need a little bit of help from our lovely Nikki because she was a part of um, a little event earlier on. So I'm going to go straight into the photos. Okay. And what sometimes happens when you guys were doing the sunset specials earlier on, I went off and had a little bit of a wander around. So um, took a picture of you. Here's you. I'm telling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do well, there I am. There That's you go. Saying. Yeah, there you go. Um, and then I went ahead one. There's Callum. Oh. Now, Callum, the lovely Callum, he's um, moving on to new ventures. I he's know. setting up his own little business, yeah. bless him. But he says he so. doesn't want a do. We need to give him a do. Oh, we'll definitely have. We can't go without a do. No, that's it. I think it's Sundays. His last I think day. The, the nice thing is he's actually leaving, but then he's coming back to do some overtime. Lovely <laughs> as a freelancer. So, so he's, he's not really he's leaving. Not really <laughs> so like that fiver back out of the collection, if that's yeah. all right, everybody. Um, our lovely Hannah. Oh, oh look at love our Hannah there. She gets. She was all asking sorted. some tricky questions before we came. Was she? Honestly, oh, what yeah. was she saying? Is this about the the colours? Yeah. Yeah, oh, honestly, very okay. tricky questions. I was oh, like, yeah. guys, it's my first day. I don't know the answers to these. <laughs> um, we've got some fabulous shows coming up tomorrow as well. Marvelous. Saturday morning, 10 o'clock, traditionally our um, jewellery hour. Mm -hmm. So we've got some lovely things coming this up. I'm trying not to get the glare on this. this in the other this. studio. Are you into jewellery? Oh, mad on jewellery. See, this might be your first craft. Mad Who knows? on jewellery, honestly. Yeah. 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 Um, we've got a little bit of MDF coming up as well. Oh, that. That's um, good. Definitely um, a Chanda-themed birthday show yeah. with regards to those, as you can see there. Um, um, of course, one day special. That's kind of our lovely Shana. Aww. Shana's looking after us. She's actually, oh, oh, it oh, oh it's a bit on. short. Can you? We're trying to. <laughs> Hey, Shana. Hey, Shana. Let's pop that in. Charge that up because we don't need to use this. Because we've got another photo. Oh, there's Snowy with a, the hat. There you go. I love Trying these on hats. the birthday hat. Yeah. I think you'll grow into it. Yeah. Yeah. There's room for girls. Now, Nikki. 
well, teacup challenge. What is this all about? Because neither myself or no, Alex has got involved with well, it. Well, I didn't know either. So I was literally just walking down the corridor and I was due to be on air at one o'clock. And this happened before then. They said, Nikki, we don't have anyone to do the teacup challenge. Can you do it? Okay. So I said, yes. Because I thought, well, it's my first day. I should appear keen. <laughs> so I said, yes. Didn't really know what I was saying yes to. And they were like, it's a bit like that game you play when you've had a few drinks and you're trying to get the ball in the certain cups and you oh, know okay so i said well i've never played that they were like, i've never played it i said no they said it's really easy you basically got this ball you've got to try bounce it on a table and try and get it in said amount of cups so i think there was five so i was like okay and they were like oh and we're filming it i was like oh great and they were like oh and it will be with lou it was like yeah come on oh I'm yeah competitive. <laughs> and yanis is is the judge of it so I eating thought, his buffet this, this, is getting, <laughs> this is all getting a bit serious and there's going to be a prize so anyway we played the game you'll get five goes each yanis was in charge um and none of us got <laughs> none of us got any points until the end when i did but it deflected off an area of Lou, as she said, off the boob. Right. Lou's words, not mine. Uh, and that gave me the winner. Hey. Uh, so, yeah, so I won. And the prize, which I showed you, and I you think, did. to be honest, you were a bit jealous, oh, weren't you? Was very jealous. was a signed photo of Yanis. Yeah. Oh, yeah. saying, well done, uh, yeah. of Yanis. Who so that want? was my prize. Oh. Um, but I'm very, I'm loving the prize. I put a picture of it on my Facebook, actually. Ooh, I'm nice. going to put this... it up in my house, Yanis. Is this your new Facebook page. Oh, oh, we need, need to get, get Nikki likes. likes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, Facebook page, so I'm excited about that. So I'm going to do loads of pictures behind the scenes of you all. Yeah. Watch out. Ooh. All right. Uh, try okay. and get Yanis on the next buffet, eating the buffet again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Really? He should be bringing cakes in for everyone, I think. Well, he's back in tomorrow, he? so I think, yeah, it's yeah, going to be, we're going to shame him. Shame yeah. him into getting us something else. So it's Nikki McEwen? Yeah, Nikki McEwen on Hachanda TV. Lovely. Lovely. So we'll please, please that. come and like. That would be really awesome. Aww, but looking forward to seeing what I'm glad you got to do the, the teacup challenge because uh, Catherine had a bit of an initiation when she Did joined she? us as a presenter and she had to do a cracker challenge. Oh no. And it was how many crackers that she could get in her mouth without bits falling out within, was it three minutes or something like that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it, yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely got me. I think you're going to have to do the teacup challenge. I think I'm, everyone's going yeah, to do it. I think I'm the adjudicator tomorrow between Phil Martin and Nikki Hassan. Oh, that would yeah, be good. Yeah. Oh, yes, because Phil's in tomorrow. Oh, Phil. Oh, I'm dying to meet him. Yeah. He's such a hoot. Oh. He'll do embossing as well. Oh, no, but you're not here. Damn, I'm not right, here Tuesday, Tuesday. Yeah, <laughs> Tuesday, embossing, please. <laughs> Lovely stuff. Well, Nikki, it's been a pleasure working Absolutely. with you. Absolutely. Thank you. Please. And thank you both for being so welcoming and Aww. so supportive. Because I've had messages off you both, and it honestly has been so nice for me. I yeah, love it. You're welcome. Now, of course, Alex is going to be coming up straight after the break with more from the One Day Special. We've got Maria. Um, of course, she's showing you the ropes of the One Day Special. Um, but uh, yeah, there's more to come through the nighttime hours. So uh, yeah, do stay tuned to us, and I will see you nine o'clock in the morning with our lovely Nikki. Uh, Okay, so coming up next, crafting celebrations with Clarity. That's with our lovely Alex. Next, picture this, and then later, crafting celebrations with Clarity. Great shows ahead. See you soon. Hi, everyone. I'm Phil Martin. I've been paper crafting for over 20 years now. You could say it's a passion of mine. Uh, Sentimentally Yours is my award-winning brand of craft products. I design stamps, paper pads, uh, tools, embellishments, all the things that we need to help us enjoy our crafting. My aim with Sentimentally Yours is to bring unique, top quality, innovative designs for every level of crafter. So whether you are a beginner or whether you are more experienced, there will be something for you. On my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda, I will be doing my best to teach and educate you on how to get the most from the product, but always with a laugh and a giggle. Make sure you join me and tune in for my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ho-Chanda. Follow the white rabbit, but try not to be late. Follow the white rabbit for our very important date.
Join us for clarity, La Blanche and Craft 2. Studio Light, Roll Talons, Sentimentally Yours, and Katie Sue. Visit us in Crafterland, a week of celebrations. Seven days of offers as we thank the nation. We'll credit your account with 10% of what you spend. For Hochanda's fourth birthday, the fun will never end. Customers, suppliers, team and community. The big four are our values, working in close unity. Join us in August. Our celebrations will be grand. Welcome to the Big Four in Ho Chanda's Crafter Land. Hello and good evening, and it's your second hour of the One Day Special. Uh, Maria, what what a busy hour. Very busy, Oh, yes. this is so good. I've been told <laughs> half the stock, approaching half the stock gone, which is excellent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You pleased? I am pleased yes. because, they're, you know, they're beautiful stamps and they've been such good fun to play with, mm -hmm. so... Yeah. Do you want to talk us through the design? Yes, certainly. So uh, we have a set of four of our Christmas branches uh, or mounted stamps. These were designed by our Mel, Mel Turner. And what we've got within each set, we've got a beautiful uh, sentiment there in a fabulous font. And then we've got a main kind of branch, if you like. So here we've got the ivy, for, for example. And then what we've got is a couple of offshoots mm -hmm. of the ivy. Um, and then you'll notice, you see the little eight very tiny stamps? So those are very good fun because what we've got there is the, the line art and the infill for those tiny little stamps. So you can either use the, the sort of the full size branch on its own or you can bring into play the little sort of add-on um, pieces and you can uh, you can fill your branch out or you can extend it um, mm. or you could just use those on their own and then of course with the little ones you can just make tiny bits of art you can just sort of piece add extra yeah. little leaves in um, and again you can color those just by having the two different stamps so whether you want to color you, if you're a, you know you like your coloring yeah. you just use the main branch and just sort of color of that in nice. but if you want to use the little ones fabulous isn't that good really cool now the, the one you just looked at was by jane telford yeah it's always nice to um <coughs> say who the design team it are. is yeah so this is an an uh dimitrio <laughs> Andy, Andy. Um, so this is really lovely and Anne's actually worked a, a groovy parchment lovely. in with this stamp in here as well so this is on parchment so we've got a groovy border there and then Anne has um, embossed in white onto the parchment and then done some lovely colour in there as well very elegant looking beautiful this is nice sort of watermark effect yeah so this is day so we've got a sort of an inky background and then that kind of crescenty moon kind of shape mm. D is actually built that up just using the tiny little stamps from one of the sets of the branches. Oh, isn't How that clever? clever? Very just clever. Fun. And this one's nice because it's like clean and simple. Yeah, so this one is from Elaine, Elaine Milner. So she's used the, the naked branch and then she's used the stars um, just to, to turn that into a lovely sort of Christmas tree. Oh, I love this as a bookmark. Yeah, How clever. bookmarks, lovely. You know, it's gifty then, isn't it? Something yeah. that people can keep. Um, so again, Anna's used the, the holly, the main sort of branch. And then she's also used from the, the, the tiny sort of berries from the, uh, from the berry yeah. uh, branch as well. There we go. So this from Carol. Carol's actually used this in conjunction with a stencil. So the large holly there is a stencil. And then she's used the sentiment and the little offshoots there from the corners of the mm. sentiment. And then the background, just nice and subtle. You'll see there that she stamped the, um, the holly there as well. Beautiful. And as always, I will show you oodles more samples mm -hmm. as we go through the show. I do want to mention yes. Barbara's been very generous. Very generous indeed. This yeah. is the free gift for the mm -hmm. birthday event. 
how lovely is this? These Barb's faves? They are Barbara's favourites, yes. Yeah. So what we've got here is the pack of 10 parchment mm -hmm. and the pack of 10 paper as well. So uh, you've got, uh, there's 10 sheets, there's two designs, lovely. five of each. But the colours are very much sort of, they coordinate. You can use these designs together. Love it. But the, the thing is, when you said you're not choosing, you're getting both, uh -huh. I thought, gosh, that is so generous. Now, it is well stocks for uh, last, so you need to sort of be shopping ahead first. Mm -hmm. First come, first serve. That's the expression I was trying to think of. Oops, there we go. <laughs> so the one-day special is 52 stamps. Yeah. That works out at just 48 pence per stamp. So reasonable at £24.99. pence. Saving £15.796474. Now we've also got, of course, the matching groovy plates. Yes, we have. So mm. we've got the same artwork, only in groovy form. So now this one, just ever slightly different. Um, what we've got here, we've got the sentiment. Yeah. And we've got the, the main branch, but in two sizes. There you see. You see on each of the plates, we've got it in a large size and a smaller size as well. I see. And then also, just tucked away up there in the oh, corners, oh, you'll oh. see you there are, there you go. So there is also a really cool, clever corner on each of the plates as well right. very, very light corners yes absolutely <laughs> and we'll have a look at some of these beautiful there you samples go. speaking of corners so this is mrs panky our carol so she's used the uh, the happy christmas uh, sentiment and the and the holly corner there as well really elegant mm. um so this is cool from josie so what josie's done here is she's actually extended um the the holly leaves out and, and just made her own kind of shaped um sort of what would we call that oh. um, a bow of holly, Ooh, and I'm sure a bow shape of, of holly. I like that word. Lovely. And also, don't forget, we can interchange the, the sentiments as well. You know, you can take the sentiment from one and, and put it with, with another yeah. one. Like it. Here we go. Frances, really, really lovely. So again, Frances is like these corners. This is the ivy corner. And also, see, so ivy to me, you know, even the holly, if you take away the Christmas sentiment, um, there's nothing here that says Christmas. No. I like that. Yeah. I do like that. You, it's, we, we, we don't like a one trick pony, do we? We no, like lots not. of versatility. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, well, that's beautiful. Another one from, from Francis there. Isn't that pretty? Mm. Really nice. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this one, this look at all the Emma. patchwork as well. Yeah, that's really nice, isn't it? So, mm. again, love and best wishes. Really, really nice. And so, if you'd like to go for this, it's seventeen pounds and ninety-seven pence. We're over forty percent of the stock gone on this particular set. Three three six six one six. Now, should we stand either side of the tree yes. so we're not blocked? But we've got <laughs> two different sets of acrylic baubles for you. Yeah. Um, so we've got the acrylic shapes, sorry, yes. rather than the ball balls. But what will, what mediums will these take, Maria? Just all sorts. Okay, so I've been using them. I could, I've been stamping on them. A lot of the team have been heat embossing on them. Great. We can use, uh, and, and over the, today and tomorrow, I'll be using Gildan Flakes. Uh, I will be using uh, alcohol inks. And I will also be using a really cool paint. Mm. It's a Viva paint. Right. But it's, uh, it's Viva colour, and it's actually a vinyl paint. Oh. And I'm really looking forward to sharing how very cool this paint is. I don't think I've the, seen it. Shapes. It's great. It yeah. really is good. Uh, we can use glitter on here as well. And of course, the very, very cool mirror mist as well. I haven't seen that either. Oh, you need to see that. Oh, excellent. Yeah, it's brilliant. Uh, so we've got two different sets. We're in, again, we see, I love this tree. It's such a lovely way to display it. So the first set that we've got are the assorted shapes. You get 42 of these for £12.49 pence. 40% of, you have been busy, 40% of the stock's gone, uh, <laughs> 076467. And then we go on to the ball balls, so something for Christmas. Yes, exactly, yeah. that's right. So, um, and they've all got holes in them as well, so they're great for making, you know, danglies. So you can dangle them from trees, you can dangle them from your cards. You know, a couple of the ladies on yeah. the team um, have made, uh, you know, cards, pop-out cards where, where they're dangling from the cards. Oh, that's good, I'll have to um, say that one. There's, this is beautiful, this one that you've got uh, at the moment from Linda. Um, this is actually using the, the one-day special as well there. Mm. Um, some gilding flakes and... And, um, some heat embossing that is just stunning isn't it yeah. really very very lovely and, and it looks so expensive as mm -hmm. well there you uh, go. here we go I like this so this is from Elaine clever there you go. that's beautiful yeah 
I really like that. It's fun because you get a little surprise, don't you? Yeah. Oh, what and about then, making jewellery? Exactly. Now here, so this is Sarah, but all of a sudden these baubles don't really look like baubles. No, they, don't. they they are dangly um, earrings. Fabulous. So that's very very cool. Shall I do one more? Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh. Oh, it's, this is some more. This is Jane. Jane oh. had the same idea for for earrings. And on the front of the packaging. Yes, there you go. How cool is that? I really like that. Yeah. Now we're approaching, oh you like these too, um, we're approaching 80% of the stock Ooh. gone. Very, very busy indeed. Well, they're just 9 99 and you get 30 of them. Yeah, they're great. Yeah, 425579 is your item number. And then last but not least, so we've got the acrylic bookmarks. Oh, have you even given us the sleeves as well? Yes, oh, absolutely. Good. And they were sized to fit in. These are our actual Pergamano um, bookmark they? sleeves. So they were sized to fit into the Pergamano um, sleeves. These are great. So you're going to get six. They The hole is pre-drilled for you, so you right. can put your ribbon through or your tassels or whatnot. Look. Um, well, this, I mean, this is D. So it's, it's just, it's a Christmas hanging. It's no longer, you know, bookmarks. How cool is that? So clever. The design mm. team have the most brilliant imagination yeah and they absolutely do they yeah. really inspire us ah yeah. so you're saying very, about very inky yeah there you go looks like uh, like lou withers has had a hand <laughs> on that one doesn't it really yes yeah um what else have we got oh, this, show some, that one's really one. really nice okay there we are there you go paint um on there as well mm. i can't remember who did that i'm so sorry and then um if i give a little uh, sneak preview of yes. a couple of bookmarks that i've got um okay. to demo as well so one okay. using and um, this is some other stamps that we've got on the show as well so one's using uh, the paint uh, that i've been talking about with uh, mirror mist yep. and the other one is just the paint that ivy um, i'm really looking forward to demoing the, the ivy with the paint it's just it's cool wonderful Ten pounds and seventy-five pence. We are approaching half the stock gone. One, two, eight, nine, two, nine. Oh, good. I like it when we have a video to show you because <laughs> again, we want to show as much inspiration as possible. So take a little look. And so this is the card you're going to be it working is. towards. Yeah. So we're going to start with groovy this time because uh, we did stamps in the, in the last hour. So that'll be on catch up for anybody that sure. didn't um, see the launch. Yeah. yeah lovely. It's nice. Okay. To, it's nice to have stamps and the groovy. Yeah. Mix it up. Yeah. yeah it's I like nice that. Let's look after everybody, isn't yes. it? Right. Okay. So now, would you believe me if I told you that that main uh, piece is from one one small element? on one of the plates. No. Okay. <laughs> well, it is. Show that again. <laughs> it Have is. a little look. Okay. <laughs> Go for go. it. Okay, right. So first of all, uh, the size of the plates. Okay, so they are um, A6 in size. All right. So when it comes to our standard plate mate, when we pop this in, if I just switch on my, um, my, my light. Oh, hang on a minute. I wanted to explain my light panel, didn't I? Oh, yes. It's not quite plugged in because I wanted to show that we've got choices here with the light panel that I'm using. Ooh. So it's got a, a USB uh, connection. So I've got choices. With this, we've got the the plug mm -hmm. okay so you can plug this into the mains or if you're out and about okay then you may there's lots and lots of people now um, investing in these sort of uh, portable power banks these are really great this is uh, this is smashing so this will do so for me I'm gonna go with sure. my portable bank okay so it's nice to have choices so I'm gonna switch this on I'm gonna switch it on and press three times so I get it nice and bright yeah okay um, so what you'll see here now is we've got this gap yeah. yeah see all right so if you wanted the plate to sit nice and snug if you have got for example the groovy go kit yeah all right this will fit in because that is the size of the aperture but if you've sort of you've only just sort of made the plunger you've only got your your regular starter kit then what we have is various what we call spacer plates mm. and they've all got designs on so I literally I just picked up the first one um, that, that I came to because th that will fit fine I've got a little some of them are longer okay this one would go 
that way but it, it's going to do the job that I want so this now isn't going to move I see okay so um, lots of traces so I'm going to start then with a piece of parchment now this is the piece that I'm um, I'm concerned with you can see you know, there's a lot on here you've got the beautiful large branch and then you've got the small branch and then this really beautiful um, sentiment here mm. but this is the piece that I'm interested in so what I'm going to do just to make my life a little bit easier <coughs> is I'm going to turn the plate around I'm going to pop that up there still fits nicely and this is what I'm interested in I'm going to put this at a little bit of an angle as well and then I'm going to come in with my parchment so I'm going to start about here and then I'm going to secure my parchment down I'm going to I'm cracking open some new groovy tabs you'll find those on the website they're mm -hmm. very handy aren't they they are yes I mean they are reusable um, and they're they're washable and, and so forth as well I only crack open new ones when I come to TV do you otherwise they have like Tilly hairs on like oh. little little white Jack Russell hairs yes. and, um, and then there'll be a rabbit hair on there as well oh, and stuff like that what's so, the rabbit called uh, Bonnie Miss Bonnie <laughs> Miss Bonnie what type of rabbit is it um, she's a lop she's a, a blonde <gasps> lop yeah she's, she's blonde lovely. She's, yeah, she's, mm -hmm. yeah she's got blonde attitude <laughs> she's lovely yeah it's like a safari park in our house why what other animals have you got um, well, we've got well the kids for one thing um and um and i've got a balding canary he's really old a balding he's canary. Balding, so he's, he's got about three feathers left on he his head he could do a comb over us yeah no he hasn't got enough feathers left to do that bless him so funny <laughs> yeah so lots of animals right here we go so this is where i'm going to start so i've secured um the parchment down with my groovy tabs and we give it a little wipe mm -hmm. with the tumble dryer sheet now this comes in the starter kit for anybody that's thinking they might be interested in this we have got the starter kit on the show mm -hmm. and the um the tumble dryer sheet leaves just a little bit of slick on your parchment so that your tool will glide around easier very okay? handy so all i'm going to do now here so i'm going to lean on my groovy guard now this also comes in the same pack as the groovy tab so it's uh, the accessory pack and you get the the groovy guard that I'm using right now yeah you get the groovy tabs and you also get another a pack of 20 sheets of a5 parchment so you can top up on your parchment that's good we're just popping the details onto the screen there for your groovy accessories just 11.99 211682 yeah it's a good thing to have okay so uh, the tool that I'm using because I'm further down my sort of groovy and parchment journey I'm now using my peg mono uh, tools they're a little bit more uh, luxurious the the starter kit tools will do the job mm -hmm. and you can see in the instructions which one to use but when you realize that you absolutely adore groovy and it's going to be something that you do for a long time mm. you might want to then sort of um, you know move on to the you know the, the the more luxurious sort of tools yeah. okay so this is the one mil embossing tool so you can see here I've got the lovely uh, Holly or oh, I've missed a tiny little bit there there we go all right so what I need to do now is reposition my parchment okay so I'm gonna come up here now oh, right, okay I need a little bit I can come down here but what I did was I was thinking about the size of my letters mm -hmm. because if I go to my plate that says joy because I'm going to put a J and an O and a Y so these letters must fit in this little space yeah yeah and as it stands they won't so what I need to do is just elong my little shape if you like mm -hmm. so if I go to about there like that and again I can come in and check so I think J is my largest letter so that's going to fit nicely okay yep so stick my parchment back down let me just reposition that tab over there here we go and then I'm going to do the same again now as far as pressure um, I'm giving this just some nice firm pressure um, the plates are precision etched they're deep enough that mm -hmm. you're gonna get this really nice crisp white but you're not gonna there's no way for the tool really to go to sort of tear the parchment so don't be frightened if you are you know somebody that tends to have a you know light hand sure don't worry about it give it give it a press because not only will it help you get the really nice crisp white it will also help you to to stay within those grooves as well lovely okay there we go so just follow the design around and it's yep. really nice and quick lovely isn't it yep. that's the thing with the groovy system is that because I'm a I am a an impatient crafter yep. I want to see results and this mm -hmm. allows you to 
Yeah, me too. I mean, you know, I, I'm a, my background is stamping, you know, mm -hmm. so I'm used to quick results. So, um, so this is great. So now what you can see there, we've got this lovely kind of ovally shape now. It's really pleasing, actually. It's, it is, yeah. actually. It's nice and kind of curvy, isn't yeah. it, really? So, um, so what we want to do now is just kind of, they're still sort of separate, aren't they? So yeah. So we're kind of joining it together a little bit. Okay. So I'm going to come to these little ones here now. So let's have a little look. I can add in. I could fit two more in there or I could just put one in there mm -hmm. I could do whatever let me see if I did it there we go right I'm gonna to move to this one sure because what I've done here is I've done exactly the same again only I've moved out sideways so I've moved out to the left yeah and I've moved out to the right see that's the middle one makes yeah? sense okay so let's I'll get my groovy tabs back mm -hmm. from there so now we've got the three uh, will Barbara be watching <coughs> Um, possibly she might be having a tea. She will oh. be exhausted because she's been at the retreats. Oh. Um, so if she if she is, I hope you've had a great day, Barb. Okay. Lots of love. Hi, Barbara. Here we go. Right. So I think I'm going to go just for one extra okay. leaf. Okay. Just I'm going to put it about there. This is the beauty of the, the, the parchments as well. We can see through. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm just going to stick that down, and I'm going to pop. There we go that into there like so as I say if you want to put a couple in, it's up to you you can make it sort of as busy but you can see already at that side yeah it now looks more full doesn't it nice so we're going to move over to this side now look and get the the corresponding piece mm -hmm. like so same again there we go like oh hang on hello there we go that's it Lovely. Mm -hmm. So now all of a sudden it's a right. it's a noble. Lovely. It's okay. perfect, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Right. So I'm going to just do the same on those. Do you need a minute yet? Or I could. You, I could do some numbers. Or I can carry on. You tell me what you'd like me to do. What would you like? Oh, they're doing something. What are you doing? Voices in my head. Right. Let me tell you about the free gift. <laughs> Shall I do this? Here we go. In fact, this is our free gift, and I'll show you in a minute. <laughs> uh, free gift. So simply place an order for a product featured within our live shows, and you'll automatically receive a free gift worth up to sixteen ninety nine. Uh, with each supplier giving away a different free gift, there will be over thirty up for grabs. Full T's and C's are on the website. Now, the free gift, though, on this show. Barbara's been super, super generous because she's given us 10 sheets of her favourite parchment and 10 sheets of her favourite papers. That is really nice um, to, to, give, to, to receive this. I should just say it's while stocks last, so it's better to order sooner rather than later to make sure that you get it. But let's have a look at the one day special. It's all about these absolutely glorious stamps. They're so beautiful. We can see through them, so we can see where they're stamping. You, with Barbara stamps, you always get a really nice, clear, crisp image. I like that we've got the little silhouettes as well as the open. Now, these lend themselves for colouring, if you like to do that. Stamping and embossing, of course, which is my favourite, favourite thing to do. But they're beautiful. I mean, the fact that you've got 52 stamps in total is just awesome. 48p each. Now, this is by Anne. This is absolutely stunning. She's popped on here, on these ones, I think a little bit of a glossy accent, something like that, or a pearl drop. And that looks really sweet, doesn't it? Very nice in the black and the white. Really stunning. This one is by Dee. Oh, she's gone to town and popped a big bow on it as well. But I like her, uh, like her colours that she's chosen with the dark and the green. It's really effective. We've got another one here which is by Andy. Uh, it's, lo it's lovely because that looks a little bit aged and a little bit distressed. Very nice. Then we've got a card. Now, this is good. This is using some of the acrylic shapes as well as a centerpiece, but then a really nice border all the way around and some little, some little, gem, little gems on there. Lovely Christmas pudding. I like that they've, he's turned it into that. Um, who was this by? Sorry. Oh, do, 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 do. Thank you, Linda. I couldn't <laughs> see your name. There we are. And we've got another one here by, this must be Linda's as well. Mm -hmm. I love that she puts a huge description on the back. Yeah, how mm -hmm. she does it. But very, very nice. It's just your central border. And then I'll do one more uh, because this one is by Sarah. Sarah Brennan. And it's lovely stamped and embossed in the gold. It catches the light, doesn't it? 
right fifth what 50 percent have we right 50 percent of the stock has gone 24 pounds and 99 pence this is a whopping 15 pound saving 796474 is your item number we do have the matching groovy plates which we've just seen maria working on of those designs they're really pretty i love it when we get both so we're pleasing everybody if you're a stamper or if you love to do your parchment work now we're approaching half the stock. I know a lot of you do both and a lot of you I think are going for both sets. Yeah, I would. I would definitely. I've just been filling Nikki in on uh, how uh, our new presenter on how even though she's not a crafter now, yeah, she will be. <laughs> uh, now some samples here. Let's bring these up. This one, oh, this way. This one is by Glynis. Isn't that absolutely stunning? lovely parchment uh, work I love she's added a ribbon down here you've got the joy in the center and she's also done some color coloring in behind them um, this one is by Emma Emma Burns look at that white work isn't it absolutely stunning with that season's greetings beautiful and here we've got one by uh, Linda Page that's absolutely stunning I love that flash of gold and the way that you've cut it out is just stunning oh this is also gorgeous look at this with the piece how, I don't know how long that would have taken but I mean it's worth it that's incredible that is by Glynis oh you see that's when you can really get into the zone though cutting all of those out it's wonderful and then last but not least this one is by Ronk I don't think I've met Ronk Mm -hmm. mm. relatively new oh person. yeah talented. I can see look at this this is a absolute beauty to receive love all of this now this is 17 pounds and 97 pence right it's four for the pi price of three which is good 1797 336616 is your item number now the acrylic shapes which I've learned from Maria you can throw all sorts of different mediums at. Now you've got 42 shapes in totals. You've got diamonds, you've got circles, ovals, squares. Pop them on your cards, hang them from a little display, uh, make them as jewellery. We're approaching half the stock gone, 1249 We've also got acrylics in the ball ball shapes. We're over 80% of the stock gone, 999. 45579 and then last but not least of the acrylic collection we have the bookmarks and I love that the Pergamono book what do you call them sleeves thank you thank you have been put in as well and the acrylic uh, borders they match perfectly how much have we we 50% of the stock gone 10 pounds and 75 pence 128929 all you need to do is give us a call 01733 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. Right, okay. So you've just finished right, that. Right, so I've just sort of joined these together now. So they're more, they're definitely, you know, an, an oval shape rather than two corners, yeah. you know, coming together. So I've made a start. I've put the J in here. Okay, so this is the plate that we're on now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we need the O in here. Let's see, that's about looks about straight we'll go for it there we go there. and then we've got the Y over here here we go stick that down mm -hmm. mm, it's not quite right there you go that's yeah. it okay I'm gonna press oh my god and I'm gonna put the Y in place oh Barbara she's emailed in is she Oh, oh, okay. Oh, nice. um, uh, Charlotte's going to print it out rather than oh, okay. feed me through my head. All right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Bob. Hello. <laughs> right, here we go. So now, a couple of little bits that we can do. While we've got this plate on the go, yes. we've got these lovely little berries. Let's use some. Okay. okay? So we're just going to put a couple. Let's have a little look. Let's go up here like so. So I'm not securing anything down at this point because I'm okay. just going to be moving around quite quickly. Let's get one, sort of, so it's sort of overlapping there. Nice little cluster. Yeah, little cluster, and then a little lonely one over there. Ah. Yeah, he, he's <laughs> growing all in a way, all of his own. Right, let's go <laughs> on the bottom bit as well. There we go. Let's go here. There we go. And let's see. We we'll just put three down at the bottom. It's nice playing with the design, isn't it? It absolutely is, you know. Here we go. So now we've got some 
the berry so I would do that on all three yeah okay so we're done with the plates for, for the moment okay. or actually do you know what no let's do the border sure Should we do the border of course yes okay. of course so I'm going to move away from these plates now I'm going to bring into play and we're hoping this is on the website it's our scallop nested um, squares extended right. frame with with alphabet okay. this is a, a very cool plate so let's have a little look so I need now you'll see my work is rectangle rather than square That's oh okay Barbara's given a lovely message Has oh she? you are lovely and she's calling us lovely she says hello lovely ladies thoroughly enjoying two of my favorite friends doing Aww. a cracking job of entertaining and inspiring Thank happy you. birthday Hachanda love always Barb Mwah. yeah but is Barb <laughs> in is Barbara coming in at some um, point she is in mm. next weekend next She's weekend got some very cool stuff oh yeah. lovely very, thank you so much nice. Barbara. Thank you, Barbara I'm sure I'll be in I live here at the moment <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> right here we go that was a nice surprise that was yeah right okay so what I want here look is I want this double line here and I just want the corner yeah for the moment you'll see why in a sec and then I'm going to just need one scallop and then I'm going to pop these along like so these are lovely I love scallops mm. I really do they're pleasing they are they're a nice shape but actually they're really good for practicing your white work and your perforating and cutting as well how long have you been parching for when did you start well I tried the traditional I was trying to learn that uh, when we were on holiday in France um, about it would be five years ago now I suppose right. um, and uh, Sylvia Marshall who's on our design team was teaching me oh. but then when I got home you know all sort of I couldn't do it oh, I really right. couldn't do it and quite by accident while doing my clarity stamping and whatnot I had one of our mega mounts on the on mm -hmm. the table and it got marked by a piece of uh, parchments because right. it's got a grid on it yeah and it marked it and I thought Ooh, oh I wonder yeah and um, yeah so little little brainwave there <laughs> and uh, I couldn't wait to see Barbara yeah <coughs> and tell her your yeah, idea and I said this is what I think and um, and she thought it was a great idea so um, yeah it was yeah very exciting and groovy was born oh yeah <laughs> yeah it seems like a, a lifetime ago now and yeah it's lovely right here we go so what I'm doing now I'm looking down here mm -hmm. okay to here I want to make sure my design is now in there this so if I follow this frame around can you see that yes so perfect. it's all in so I can now stick that down mm -hmm. and I can I'll continue down here and along the bottom there there we go on the sides and then I will put and I'm gonna lean on my <coughs> excuse me, I'm gonna lean on my groovy guard for and this. And again, you can find your groovy guard in the accessories pack. It's well, well worth having, mm. it really is. Um, not only for what I'm doing at the moment, because parchment doesn't like to be handled. It doesn't like sort of, you know, the natural oils in, in your skin. It's not mm. about having mucky palms. <laughs> it's yeah. because it, it's not. It's about your natural oils. Mm. But also, because of the little apertures that are in there as well, they're really great for um, holding your parchment down when you're doing your perforating with your multi-tools yeah. and that sort of thing. And also, if you want to kind of just zone in on a little area, it helps you concentrate mm. on one little area rather than a larger design good idea and that's at the bottom of the screen for 11.99 you get 20 a5 sheets of clear parchment paper the groovy guard and 16 <coughs> something <laughs> it won't fit on the bottom of the screen <laughs> right. oh the groovy tabs thank you I was just and 16 go. I don't know what <laughs> <laughs> all right so we're done now with the plates so we've got our artwork we've got the frame in place so I'm going to switch my light panel off right. I'm going to uh, just slide that over to the side mm -hmm. so we can do a little bit of white work nice. now so uh, I have got yeah uh, so I've got my pink excellent embossing mat but if you were um, using your starter kit or if you wanted to you were just sort of taking the plunge mm. then you would use the the foam side yeah. of your uh, of your black mat right okay 
so but this one is very good for if you are heavy handed it, it does help and again it's where you you know move on down your parchment groovy mm. journey and you think actually I like some more deluxe sort of goodies yes. you see okay so what I use my black mat now for it's not wasted no. I use the solid side for my colouring and, and a general craft mat yeah. but I also use this side for perforate you'll see I it's full see, of holes yeah, there you yeah. go so it's not you know it's not done with and, and redundant at all right so I'm going to work on the same side of the parchment as, as I have been working on um, and I'm going to use a couple of embossing tools now so oh, look at your lovely bag with all the bag, things in yes indeed mm. it's lovely I think that's on the website as well good yep here we go <laughs> right so I've got choices we have got weapon of choice oh, yep We've got ball tools, mm -hmm. embossing tools, and we've got shader as well, okay? So it's kind of personal choice. Yeah. People prefer have a, have a preference, and sometimes, depending on what I'm doing, will depend on which tool. So, for example, I tend to, in my scallops, I'd like those just nice and just a soft sort of white, but mm -hmm. a solid colour. Yeah. So I tend to use my ball tools for that, but I could use my shader. But where I use my shader is if I want my white to graduate away I mm. find this is easier for me because right. it's just I get a, a much softer oh yeah sort of uh, you know look with that rather than the ball tools if I want it to um, you know just sort of gra graduate away but for these I, I'm going to use a ball tool so this one I've got a three mil and got a 4.5 mm -hmm. now you might think the 4.5 is actually too big for that yeah not so oh, because here's right. the thing um, and people kind of don't tend to, to realize this the ball tool or those 4.5 mils it's actually domed isn't it mm. so there's not actually 4.5 mils of metal that's actually making contact with your parchment you right. see okay so don't be frightened of that so let's get my groovy guard so I'm going to come in and I'm just going to gently side by side just sweep and then maybe follow the shape around so it might look like I'm actually going outside of the shape but I'm not because remember the tools don't however if you are very nervous of that then go for the three mil sure. instead personal right? preference so, yeah there you go so I would just I moved down in sizes but there you go maybe if you are nervous go for a smaller one so there you go and again just sort of now it's not particularly white but it's definitely there isn't it yes it's there. and this is now at the point where i stop okay? it's because it's tempting to go i want it white now exactly. you know <laughs> and especially when we are stampers and that, yeah. you know we're used to and die cutters where we used to have doing things quickly this is a bit that's taken me the longest to actually say no stop yeah and let it rest and the result when you do that you know i would sort of come back to this um sort of tomorrow and you know when i've done the whole lot and it will will have softened down mm -hmm. and the parchment will have rested and I can come back and I can go whiter and you know it hasn't got to be bright white no. anyway just a nice soft white okay. okay so be patient with that so then we've got the letters and again um, for this I have used um, the, the ball tool so I've just swept I've just kind of followed the shape of the the letter really so I'm not pressing I'm, th I'm really not applying any pressure here I'm just stroking the parchment just nice and gentle like so don't get Yanis stroking the parchment <laughs> <laughs> no I won't there you go so you can see it's yeah. there it's nice and soft leave it alone okay yeah right so white work done so we can do some color now important thing now mm -hmm. we need to not be on this mat right okay? or any embossing mat why is this um because your parchment doesn't know the difference between the embossing tools and say for example it's more important if you're right. using pencils and i'll show you actually the reason and i walk around when i do my classes and my ladies and they're used to me yeah. sort of being on this shoulder you see and, and i kind of just go like that. I'm going to take it off him and just, <laughs> just move the mask and go, oh yeah, nearly. Yeah. And the reason for this is literally, so say with a pencil, say we're trying to get a really nice bright colour, all right? So we're going to press and press and press because we want that really bright, don't we? Yeah. So then when we turn over, 
It's not, is it, Locke? No. Because you kind of, the parchment thinks it's been embossed. That's so interesting. Yeah. yeah. So you can get away with it a little bit with pens because with the pen you don't tend to press as hard. But mm. as a rule, do try to get into the habit of moving to a yeah. solid surface. And this is where my well-loved black mat comes into. I was just going to say, look at all of this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. It's well-loved. It's well-loved. Right. So I'm going to use a couple of the uh, Pergamono pens. Mm -hmm. All right. The, these are really lovely. So I'm going to use a red, and I'm going to go for a couple of shades of, let's see, so I'm going to go with Ooh, nice. a green and yep. a sort of a minty colour, actually. I like to do two-tone with the um, with the holly, so uh, with the red. Now, these are fabulous. These are such good value. There's a pack of 30. Yep, we've popped details on um, the screen. Yeah, they are double-ended as well. So one end is very, very fine, so mm. you can really get in to oh, yeah. tiny, yeah, also, it's very juicy as well. These are very reliable pens. Good. And then at the other end, we've got the beautiful, you can, you know, get co cover ground quickly mm. sort of thing. Okay? So I'm going to come in. So we're going on the um, still other on side. The back, still on the back. Yeah, here we go. So I'm just literally, and I'm only going straight to, I'm not doing any clever sh sort of shading with this. I'll do clever shading tomorrow with stuff okay. and choose some cheats because I, I don't do, really do clever shading. I, I, I wing it. Okay. All right. Uh -huh. So I will show tomorrow. There you go. Now also, you'll notice I haven't been particularly neat with that. But because we're working on the back, Doesn't it's matter. okay. Because from the front, it's going to look much tidier. There Lovely. you go. Lovely. Yeah much much nicer it's nice now the pens are great if you want vibrant color this is when I, I opt for the pens if I want you know nice and vibrant if I want more soft color then I go for my um, pergolina pencils here we go so just gonna let's just color a couple of my leaves like that so I tend to with the holly just one side of the holly one color and the other side. Yes, I like that effect. With another. another. And sometimes I like green and yellow. That looks really nice. Mm. Or green and red. You know, it's um, yeah. you can get some really nice colours in the holly, can't you? And now you've got a uh, five pound saving on the pens. Twenty pounds and ninety four pence, and you get all thirty. <coughs> three three nine six five seven. There we go. So a little bit of colour in on there mm -hmm. you can see those those holly leaves um, and then what else did I do now I missed a tiny little step let oh, me okay. explain can you see on the finished oh, piece look. it looks it's got like a yellowy sort of glow on mm, there yeah. so what I did before I put this on now I think I could possibly put this on now sure. anyway yeah that would okay. be good so let me uh, root for a moment and find my crayons okay um, they're here somewhere filled I'm all sure. the drawers yeah I, I do you know what I actually have I've got like uh, I've taken over <laughs> and I'm looking at my thing I'm stepping backwards you all right? here they are here they are, here they are. oh you've got them okay, got okay. <laughs> so draw so colors these are lovely so there's a lively collection mm -hmm. and then there is a naturals collection as well these are very very cool for sort of coloring your own uh, parchment now what I would normally do let's go on to this one okay let's not risk sort of spoiling that yeah so what I would do now um, Linda Linda Williams mm -hmm. um, taught me that the best way to do this is to actually dorso your parchment first okay so Charlotte's just said oh this is the orange smelling stuff I yes, love it <laughs> it is yes it absolutely is yeah right, I'm just looking for a little bit of my okay. um, tissue there we go I knew I had some lovely all right so all I'm gonna do is just take just the tiniest tiniest little drop okay we could put some on spot on sponge that works as well okay. and then over the whole sort of design we would just give that a little bit of a, a rub okay so you can see it's there, but it's barely there. And then we'll take one of our crayons. So let's go. What colour would you like? Oh, no, I like what you did on that one. Do you? Okay, yeah, okay, we'll go with. So, yeah, it smells it's lovely, isn't it? I'd wear that as a perfume. Yeah, indeed. Obviously, you don't, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go. So just gently sort of scribble some of your colour on, like so. And then come back to your tissue. Now, make sure it mustn't be soaking. If this is soaking with the oil, yeah. all you're going to actually achieve is taking the colour back off. Right. All right. So just now, there you go. My colour is moving, but it's not coming back off. So I'm, I'm good to go. Right. So you can see, I can spread the colour around. See that? I can move it around but also see it's softening the colour yeah that looks so look. good 
and you can mix a couple of colours as well. Quite often I do do that. I'll have a darker colour mm. sort of around the edges. But what you can see there now, if we turn that over, if you've got this lovely sort of soft glow behind there and then I could go on top yeah all right if I'm got all excited and then done the, the other coloring on top of that as well lovely okay we've uh, had we've had a business proposal uh, put right. forward by uh, Charlotte and Holly oh okay My, uh, so Barbara if you're still watching <laughs> um, could you please produce a range of perfumes now and could it well be you've got nothing to do to there. <laughs> well, you know, just in your spare time and could it be called get in the groove by Barbara Gray Ooh. There you go. Yeah, like that. Like that. Yeah. Right, okay. I can't take credit. Um, yeah, Holly and Charlotte, they're 50-50. Okay, cool. yeah. crack on them, Bob. Okay. <laughs> Bless her. <laughs> oh, she's probably absolutely flaked out in front yeah. of that telly. And then, so all I've done then, I say I've finished the colouring, I've finished the white work, I've done some perforating. Um, how are we for time? Do you well, want me to do some, or do you want me to just show how we've... we've yeah, let's, it? we've got time. We've got, got like uh, about 13 minutes. Yeah, okay, yeah. come on then. Right. So so we'll go back to um, the, the light panel mm -hmm. so we can see what we're doing. So we'll come back to our part done piece. All right, so mm -hmm. we need to move that over. Am I in the right place there? Is that good? Uh, yes, Holly's yeah. saying that's fine. There we go, cool. I do try. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go. Oh, hang on, turn that on. There we go. Oh, I've turned it off. <laughs> there we are. There we go. All right, so foam. And then we're going to come on here like so and it's also let me just mention so although I'm using the the light panel for anybody that's new this isn't essential it's desirable so to do the perforating if we didn't have the light panel then I would be using my black mat yes underneath instead right okay? okay it's just that with the light panel you know it's great for um anybody you know if your eyesight isn't what it used to be maybe okay. you just need a little bit of illumination for me where this is really great is because it fits on a lap tray in the evening yeah i can still be in the living room with pete and amber pretending to watch the movie they're watching yeah and they can have just the low light on yes and i'm just there grooving away not knowing what is going on, on the <laughs> like at all it. and then they ask me questions and you're like i have you know, no idea mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> that, that bloke, that bloke. <laughs> what, that bloke, he was fit. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, that'd be fun, wouldn't it? Uh, <coughs> right, here we go. So, Pergamono, two needle, bold. Right. Okay, I like the bold um, because I get bigger holes and for me it's just easier. Right. Right, so going to use my groovy guard here so I'm going to start in my corner now the, the perforations are your, the foundation of your little picots all yeah. right so you kind of need to try and get those right okay so it's just a few things first of all um, the tool really needs to be nice and straight if I if I come in at an angle so if I come in and I just like that so first of all you'll see those holes they're they're raggy aren't yeah. they? yeah but also the, the the spacing in between them is wrong if I now come close by and do the tool straight up and down. That's it. So they're neat, but can you see also the distance between them is smaller? Yeah, much okay. finer. Need to be uniform. I say this is the foundation of your of your picos. If you you know this is what's going to make it look really really pretty. Right. So we're going to start in the corner, and I'm just going to come straight down. Are you on the line up. or just outside? No, I'm just outside. If I was on the line, we'd kind of lose our, our line okay. off. So go as close as you, you sort of dare. Now, what I'm going to do now, I'm not going to make two fresh holes. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of the needles back in the previous hole mm -hmm. so that I'm only making one fresh hole. And the purpose of that is to make sure that the distance between them mm -hmm. is absolutely uniform yes. against the foundations of the, you know, getting the holes. Now, if you struggle to actually locate, you can come in at an angle and grab your hole, yeah. but you must make sure that you bring your tool back upright before you actually perforate, okay? But again, this is where the light wave is really quite good because mm -hmm. it makes things easier to see, yeah. all right? So I'm gonna take that into the corner, I'm gonna change my direction. So as I say, tool, just nice, down, and back up. 
So I'd say, you know, like you said, it, if you're going on your groovy journey, if you haven't got these tools, they're well worth investing in. Yes, absolutely. And the thing is also, we have um, Pergamano show once a month, first Thursday of the month, and that will help you. So there'll be uh, Linda Williams and there'll be Tina Cox as well, sometimes Paul, and they will guide you through you know the different tools and how to use them and then that will help you so you know what to buy yeah. and what not to buy you know we don't want you to buy stuff that is beyond you or you know you're not going to be able to use now let's show you how to use it and then you can buy it and then you can use it and progress Marvelous. on your own journey all right so I would just follow that all the way around mm -hmm. put the lid on here and then we do a little bit of snipping. Okay. I'm still struggling with my lungs. I know, I could I'm, tell. I'm still, on, I'm still on my medication, oh. but I'm here. You're not going to keep me away at all. I was oh, no, not I know. Be here for but if you year, need so anything, I'm fine. Yeah, Colin right. has made sure I've got water, and I just, if I've just seemed like I'm, I, I kind of am, but I'm, but I'm <laughs> okay because right. I'm doing lots of talking because I get excited. <laughs> right, here we go. So the cutting. So my scissors of choice are the ring locks. Yes. Okay, these are lovely. They've got a larger um, hole for your fingers here. So if you've got sort of larger fingers, mm -hmm. or if you you know you've got sort of arthritic fingers or whatnot, yeah. then these are great. These suit me very well. But there's also the exclusive scissors, yeah. and there's the snips as well, which right. don't have the loops. So um, you, so you've got choices. All right. Now some people have the um that the ends facing downwards mm -hmm. and some people upwards that to me feels quite alien yeah I, I can't do that so for me it's facing downwards i would do that okay and then there's how to cut so tina for example she cuts down on on the mat mm -hmm. okay so she'll hold the parchment down and she'll cut down on the mat but what i prefer to do is what's called cutting on the finger right so um what it does firstly you can bring the parchment closer to yourself mm -hmm. so you can see it better yeah i need i need to hold things up yeah. here but also but what it does is because when we put the scissors in the tiny tiny tips I can feel on my finger that they're mm. there so especially when I was learning that helped me regulate how far I was putting the scissors right. in because if you put your scissors in too far you're gonna tear your lovely little little holes yeah perforations yeah okay so I'm gonna go in barely in all right down and then a tiny twist and snip and the, the okay. twist if you watch what my arm is doing with the scissors yeah okay that's Just what I'm doing it like that um, we were wondering mm. do you need the light panel to see for this no i can i can turn that but off only now. if you're, you're no, sure it's absolutely fine and i'll just shall i pop that underneath how's that is that okay yes, for you Holly's yes saying yes okay and then also the other thing uh, as well which direction do i cut from right you have the, the waist underneath your scissors so this is the waist mm -hmm. so this is the bit that i don't want to see yeah okay so that's so we're going to go in down twist and snip Okay, in, down, twist and snip, in, down. You'll notice that I'm moving the parchment as well. I'm not coming in at funny angles like this. I'm moving the parchment so I can keep that nice yep. angle. There we go. So in, down, twist and snip. And when I was learning, I actually just, I kept saying that to yeah. myself. Now I just literally, you know, I just do it in one, one motion. But it's quite a good way of, of really making it sink in, actually saying that to yourself, whether you say it out loud yeah. and drive everyone crazy or whether you actually say it just in your head, but it's actually a good way of really making it sink in, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, here we go. So I'm just gonna come along a little, oh, we've only got one more to do, haven't we? Yeah, so actually, once you get in the groove, it's uh, nice and you get in a, you do, you get on a roll. You absolutely do, and then all of a sudden you realize that you kind of, you're doing it. So let me just carefully, so you can see what I've achieved. Let mm -hmm. me just chop this away because as you're cutting along you can't really tell no you see so let me just chop to there and then we can see and then you've got yeah. your lovely neat little picos that's really cool like that. and then because right. we're running out of time you were to talk through sort of how you got to the end of the the card yeah literally i've just trimmed all the way around mm -hmm. and then i've used brads to secure it and this is one of the papers from the, uh, from the free gift we have to use those yeah so just brads and then i've just secured it onto onto a car blank nice and easy marvelous okay, okay then so we'll we'll finish off at the one day special all so right. just in case you are uh, joining us now the groovy plates we've got the set of four so I think it works out that basically you're not paying for one of them it's 50% of the stock gone which is just thank you so much for purchasing so I know you'll enjoy using them 17 pounds and 97 pence 336 616 for those 
But of course, we're coming back to the one day special. For anybody just joining us, do you want to talk us through the design? Yes, certainly. So we've got a set of four here, our Christmas branch stamps designed by Mel Turner. So each set uh, consists of a beautiful sentiment. It's uh, a standalone branch, uh, some little shoot-offs, some yeah. flourishes, and then the beautiful little tiny minis as well. So if you like to do your colouring in by hand with your pens your pencils, you know, you can do that with the main branch. Mm -hmm. And then if you want to use the little mini, for building up, you know, uh, pattern building or actually colouring them because you've got the line art and then you've got the infill as well. So you can use any combination of them to, yeah. you know, just play. And my advice would be when you get these home, just take, you know, a piece, a couple of pieces of copy paper and a black ink pad and just stamp them all out and then just play and see what shapes you can come up with and just flourishes and, and extend mm. the, the stamps and just get to know them. It's a lovely, lovely concept and mm. they are just great fun. We have time for samples. Great. Let's show this some of these. Elaine. Yes. Beautiful. So Elaine started off here with some of our designer paper and she's used the holly branch, the main branch there, and she's built out. So she's got this like, you know, it's coming off a tree there, yeah. isn't it? And then she's also used the holly on the acrylic uh, baubles there as well and coloured. Mm. Beautiful, very elegant piece. Very that. much so. And this one? This is Linda. So again, just lovely, clean and simple look here. So we've got the beautiful, uh, the sort of, you know, the berries there very Christmassy, very mm. very striking, isn't it? I love this. Yeah. Let, have a look this at this. This is D. Yeah, now this is gorgeous. So uh, D started off with our toffee apple paper pad. Yeah. And it, you can see they're sort of glistening there mm. uh, at the sides. Oh, yes. So the ivy. Okay, so D has gold embossed that and then coloured with a little bit of glitter, glitter pen. And then she's used two of the um, the acrylic shapes. One of the, the regular, the mini shapes, the square there, and then uh, the bauble. Mm. And you'll see that she's also gold embossed those as well. Yeah, that is so really cool. nice. Here's another version. Yeah, another of these. There you go. So again, so the outside piece there, uh, that's come from the Great Lakes pad. And there's just one little uh, piece there, one little front from the uh, the berry set oh yeah uh, colored and then the centerpiece there is the ivy so she's just taken that round into a frame and then again used one of the the, the bauble um, shapes there again with some alcohol Ooh, inks there we go we've got this one from Julie this is nice as well from Julie so Julie's inked a panel there and then she stamped with the uh, the holly piece and she's just built up a larger sort of background mm. there and then she used those little accent pieces there um, in the in the white area just to um, just to accent and embellish. Mm, beautiful. Or Andy. So classic uh, panel card here. So again, Andy started with some designer paper. He's used some masking tape to mask off an area. Yeah. He stamped the ivy stamp, and then he's just coloured in just a few. Yes, beautiful. Yeah. Let's see one more. There okay, this is Anne. Now, here you go. This is just so cool. Those <laughs> little hearts there. That's not a row of hearts. Yeah. That's a single heart. Is it? Yes, it is. Oh, yeah, how about that? So nice, isn't it? Yeah. Now, I must just mention, sorry, me reaching across. That's okay. Uh, Maria, this is the free gift. Yeah. Barbara's been extremely generous. She always is. Yes, I know. She is. <laughs> yeah. So what we've got is then Bob's favourites. We've got the, uh, the papers and the parchment. Mm -hmm. So there is 10 sheets in each. There's two designs, so five of each of the design. Really, really beautiful. They're lovely. I just wanted to see if I could find the other design. It's there on the back. Oh, the you've done it like that. There you right. go. Right. Oh, that, so that's the other one, that's there, yeah, that's there. Yeah, there you go. And then, oh, I may have messed this up then. <laughs> oh. I think we had a couple oh. end up on the floor, didn't we? Shall I have a little... Is right. that one? And Let's see. We've got that the one. Thing, because the parchment's translucent... Right, there we go. So that is, and there must be one more of those, I think. Yep, go for there it. There we go. We're soon sorted out. Oh, lovely. So that's that one, and yes. that is that one. There you go. Ah, perfect. How's that? Two designs, okay. five of each in the parchment, and two designs, five of each in, in the paper. Lovely. Yes. But that is your free gift, which is fantastic. But it's only while stocks last, so it's whoever you suffer. Um, Fastest come, yeah. first, thank you. That's Were you going to say fastest thing of first? Yeah, and then, <laughs> and then I all got a bit jumbled. Uh, uh, the sooner you order, the quicker you'll get it. Uh, now, for your one day special, very quickly, it's £24.99. We're over half of the stock gone. 796474 is your item number, but they really are beautiful stamps, mm -hmm. brand new today. The number to call 01733602000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. Maria, we will see you tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning, yes. Nine o'clock. Mm. Have you seen our new Christmas promos? No. 
Have a look at the, oh no birthday oh birthday, birthday <laughs> promos here's Yanis as Tweedledee and Tweedledum. <laughs> and coming up next we've got picture this followed by crafting celebrations with clarity and then we've got Samantha K industrial steampunk right I think I need a coffee. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bev. Hi, I'm Sam. And we are from Be Crafty. Be Crafty is a family run company. Sam is my sister. And we love bringing brand new products to Hachanda. We manufacture and design all our own ranges of stamps, inkables, MDF, lots and lots of inspiration that we love to bring and share with you. If you tune in to Hachanda to join us, you'll see that mine and Bev's style are totally different. But what that does is it brings you lots of styles and techniques that you can include in your crafting too. Our ranges are increasing all the time with the lovely hand-drawn images that Sam and myself are trying to bring to you, plus the fantastic new designs that we like to bring in the inkables, in the dinkables and the MDF as well. So you can use them across all different sorts of crafts and bring the best we can to Hachanda too. So make sure you don't miss the Bee Crafty shows on, on Hachanda. Hachanda. Hi, I'm Rob from Add Some Sparkle. My wife Jackie and I have been running Add Some Sparkle since 2010 as a small family business. We were both very passionate about paper craft in general, and Jackie is particularly passionate with paper embroidery, which is one of the main things we focus on now. So make sure you don't miss our Add Some Sparkle shows on Hochanda. Club G45 from Graphic45, the monthly tutorial kit that allows you to create some of the most beautiful projects by accessing a step-by-step -step video viewable online. This month's tutorial is the Club G45 Lost in Paradise Travel Album and Notebook Kit, containing the Travel Album and Notebook Set and the one-page folding mini album projects. You'll get almost everything you need to create these projects from scratch, including access to this month's step-by-step -step video tutorial and accompanying project sheet. Simply order yours by purchasing item number 974086 for £44.99, plus your postage from hochanda.com. Or give us a call on 01733 for instant access to this month's Club G45 from Graphic45. Hello. Yes, we've got another lovely hour ahead. And this is the first time, actually, I've been able to work with Andy, in this capacity anyway. Yeah, very much uh, so. So I'm really looking forward to this. It is picture this, of course. Uh, now, before we go any further, I am just going to get one little thing out of the way. I'm not going to go into the long story of it, but I am wearing a different dress to the one I was wearing earlier. If you're watching Good Morning Achanda and the 8 o'clock show, then you would understand why. And I will just point out, yes, I've got pins in the tops of my sleeves. Hayley has spent the last half hour whizzing up this outfit <laughs> for a very special reason. It is fleece, and we had it for sale on the Freedom uh, show this morning again at 3 o'clock. So if you want to buy something, you know... Just a little bit of an advertisement, but this is all about stamps this hour. So we're going to get straight to it, Andy, and we're going to go with some brand new items, aren't we? New launch today of a couple of three stamps, four in fact, actually. Certainly, and these are absolutely fabulous. So the first one we've got here is our Sibling Terrace. Sibling Terrace. So tell us all about this, Andy. Well, <clears throat> if I actually just flip that out of the way and turn that around... That's the signature terrace and the one that everybody's familiar with. That's us. Right, that's what's okay. become that's our your logo. Emblem, so yeah. to speak. Sibling terrace is called so because it matches that one. We've actually, I'm going to, I have a tendency apparently to disappear <laughs> off screen right. And I'm just going to arch this way okay. and find it, which I've laid, you see how I've laid out all oh, organised? No. I know, and now I can't see it. Oh, Andy. I know. We've found it, don't worry. No, it's a different one. Oh, no. Oh, but right, I'll okay. use this because it's... It explains it, doesn't yes. it? Yes. Okay. Now, basically, can, can you see this? There we go. Right, now look at the two and the work together. 
Ah, I okay. see. So now, what I've got to do, that's a combination with a junction and okay. it doesn't actually restrict. Let's just gone? hold this up so we can have another look it's, at it. It's this pretty actually. groovy anyway. So Here you it can is. See. Somebody tucked it up the wrong way. The two end ones are the same stamp. It's the one in the centre that's different. I couldn't do a bit of Devon with that. I'm going to show you how to do ah, that. And here, marvelous. this is the one I was looking at. Okay. We went wrong early today, so that's good. It's out of the way now. Okay, right. Right, can you see this? Signature yep. Terrace. Yes. Signature S Terrace. Yeah. Sibling Terrace. And at the Union here, they join. They right. actually match each other with no invention, you don't have to get excited, you don't have to draw anything. Okay. It actually all fits together. <coughs> Excuse me. So do you need to mask off in any way or nope. is it just a case nope. no, no just, masking? You and can I'll just try and I'll try and actually wow. demonstrate putting the two together and it working. There might be a nibble. That's amazing. But it's beyond amazing. It's Andy. It's incredible, Andy. <laughs> Andy, that is absolutely incredible. Actually, it's seriously, oh that God, really, you can do is, this again. Really, really is fantastic. Uh, we're going to see this in demonstration, but yeah. I think you can get the gist of that. That is very, very clever. So this stamp, brand new today, the Sibling Terrace. Ten ninety nine is the price for this one, 953273. You can still get the signature terrace as well. You can see the details at the bottom of the screen. Let me just so if you've not seen that before, then of course what we've just seen there on the samples, you can create. But that sibling terrace is going to make such a big difference it's if you've already got stamps uh, in advance, of course, as well. Now, I'm just going to do that for... Can you see that a little bit better? You certainly can. Can you do that? Yes, I, can't, I, can. I can't reach. I'll okay. try and find in a neater Oops. bit. I've just been careful not to stretch my arms too much so the pins don't pop out. That's there exactly why I did it. That Look at the detail in this. Absolutely incredible. So this is a sibling terrace, 1099 953 273. And just as a reminder, the signature terrace, the one that was at either end or both ends, is at the bottom of the screen, yeah. £10.99. Very pounds. kind of French. It is very, very French, French actually, yeah. Tops. And I said, I don't know yeah. whether I got there in my mind yeah. or what, I just wanted it that little bit different. Because don't forget, although it works and is designed to actually work together with the Signature Terrace, it's also very much a standalone stamp. It certainly it's is. It's very well, strong on its own, actually. Brand new, 10% of the stock has already gone, so uh, you're loving this one already, but we've got three more new todays to show you. So let's move down a little bit, Andy. Yeah, what have we got next? Uh, don't know, no. I can't reach I can't see it. They do this to me every time. I can't see it. And I'm we have got I'm on a duck the board picture. Here. Picture that, the bits of that, sorry. Yes. Two stamps in this one. Now, this is the one I pointed out. I said, oh, I like that, Andy. Yeah. This is really clever. Great price at 10 99 as well for two stamps here, 403022. So tell us about this one then, Andy. Well, as, it, as with everything with us, it seems to have some kind of a story. Yeah. Can I? You, you look, can. Look. Oh. oh wow, this is amazing. Now this, Look at this. This was shown last time. Wow. And, and I do believe we're featuring these on the show today in, okay. in, a less, in more of a supportive role. But when we featured these on the last show, and we did this panoramic thing, I've always wanted to do the panoramic thing, just to tidy it up, neaten up, make it look a bit cool. Look at the ends. Yeah. I just drew these little ditties at the this ends. One here. And everybody just fell in love with them. So what I did was I actually drew a set of stamps, and we'll show these off today, that Wonderful. actually means that you can actually complete these. It really is the finishing, finishing touch, touch isn't it? Yeah. But as ever with me, nothing simple, <laughs> except me, <laughs> I've made sure that not only do they work against their respective stamps, they can work against pretty much most everything in this scale Amazing. In, in the back catalogue. Amazing. It does really open up those different options for you again, doesn't it? So the bits of that is two stamps. So let's have a look at the stamp set itself again. I've got the uh, piece of card here so we can...